Hello, hello everybody. Trying to figure out why my graphics card is completely and utterly maxed out. I think it's because I have preview mode on on my OBS, which I will turn off here in a second. Let's see here. Turn studio mode off. Let's go ahead and transition to live. Turn my preview off. That's what it is, I think. Let's see here. Let me wait for my stream to show up on my phone. Let's go ahead and just walk a little bit here and see if it's lagging. I think it's fixed. Looks good. Okay. Ooh, dropped my phone there. Well, welcome back to more Red Dead Redemption 2 story mode. Um, if you're watching this live, welcome. Glad you guys can be here. If you're watching the VOD afterwards, I hope you guys enjoy uh, the gameplay. But uh, basically, I haven't really been playing this much this past week. I've kind of been in a lull uh, over the last few days, and I haven't really been doing much. But uh, I did log in a little bit earlier today when I... Had some free time away from work, and um, I did a little bit of stuff with the camp, but for the most part, I've been kind of just building up my own uh, my own money and storage and stuff like that. But anyway, so what we're going to do in this stream is we're going to continue on with the story. Um, I'm not going to do too much outside of the story mode. I might do a little bit of camp work, but for the most part, I am only going to be focusing on... Story mode. So, that being said, uh, we do have a few story mode missions here we can do, so I'm not going to get on my horse right now. I'm going to go ahead and uh, just work with this mission. We do have this guy that I noticed when I loaded into the game. He was tied up on a tree, so we're going to talk to him and see what's going on here. Come on, you brought me this in is uh, Kieran, I guess. Let's go ahead and let's go ahead and threaten him a little bit. Speak. Don't cry, boy. Speak about your game. Oh, this is the, the guy we got earlier. <laughs> Last stream. I remember this guy now. Boy. Whoa, hold your horses there. Here comes Dutch. It seems the uh, cat has got our friend here's tongue. I was thinking Mr. Williamson could have a word. You ready to talk, boy? I told you, mister. I told all of you. I don't know nothing, okay? They ain't no friends of mine. I just been ridden with them for a while. Oh, shit. You see, we heard that part, so how about you tell the truth? That's what you want me to do. Hurt him, so the next time he opens his mouth, it is to tell us what is going on! Ah, uh, who am I kidding? One of O'Driscoll's boys couldn't open his mouth to <laughs> tell a lie. Screw it. Let's just have some fun. Huh? Geld him. Oh, yeah! <laughs> Geld him. Oh, don't worry. You're only balls, boy. Just gonna cause you trouble. <laughs> You know, in Imperial Rome, Unix was among the happiest... Oh, boy. <laughs> this is an unexpected turn. Well, you are gonna talk. The only question is now or after we got these little fellas off. These little fellas. I know where old Driscoll was holed up. And you're right. He don't like you any more than you like him. He's at Six Point Cabin. Uh, I'll take you there. Serious, I don't like him. I mean, I like him even less than I like you. No offense. Oh, none <laughs> taken. Okay, then, partner. Uh, uh, Why don't you take a few of us up there right now? I got this, Dutch. Should be fun. All right, you. Oh, well, that guy just uh, <laughs> escaped a terrible fate. <laughs> Let's both hope you ain't trying to trick us, O'Driscoll. All right, I guess we're going to go up and uh, get into some action here. Exciting. Got everybody start the stream. John, Bill, come here. We got a social call needs making. Where are we heading? Uh, we're up into the hills behind Valentine. Good uh, dude, Gore versus Last of Us 2, Gore. <laughs> take this little with you. Any nonsense, you kill him. Sure. You gonna pay your buddies our respects. He taking us to Cole? That's what he says. Come on. I'm taking you to him. Look, I'll, I'll give you more directions when we're close. But if I know where we are, it's up past Valentine. All right, let's get right in here. I'll leave.
So can I make him go faster? No, I can only walk. It's kind of limiting my speed here. Sharing saddle with an old Driscoll. Who'd have thought? How many times I gotta say? I ain't an old Driscoll. You sure look like one, and you smell like. God damn. There you go. Now we can speed up a little bit. That's right. Boy, are you high. Morgan, you got throwing knives in your saddlebag. Dud said that you might. I was asked to give them, and I'm doing you the further courtesy of telling you about it. Throwing knives, exciting. Now we can actually ride faster. That's good. A little bit faster. Yeah, we're going to be streaming for a little bit tonight. Two, three hours. Might take a little break halfway through. But uh, we're going to make another dent a little bit further into the story mode tonight. I know this country. Take this track up through the rocks. Just finished Red Dead 2 a few months ago. Yeah, my, my sister was doing a playthrough. She was streaming and I kind of saw the ending a little bit, but like everything in between I haven't seen. I, I've heard there's multiple endings, but I've had so many people tell me that I have to play the story mode, so I'm finally doing it. This is my first time ever playing through it, so. You'd be smelling worse if we'd done what someone's arguing for. Granted, granted. So far, it is not disappointing. I'm trying to make amends if I can. You don't know the half. I do know Colm killed Dutch's sweetheart. And that's the man you chose to ride with. A woman killer. Well, it was after he killed his brother. And the way I understood it, the... Making excuses for the man and his crimes. What kind of trap you... Yeah, I apologize if I'm not talking too much. I'm paying attention to the in-game dialogue here. And he gets, uh... Into the story. But experience it from their perspective. different from the old Driscolls. What did you just say? I've been watching you all these weeks and uh... You've been tied to a tree. You don't know nothing about this gang. Yeah, well, I'd, I'd say you don't know much about the old Driscolls. But maybe I know more about you than you know about them. And I know all about them, so... <laughs> Tell us then. How are we like those mongrel dogs? Mike, am I using... I am using a Rode NT1. Uh, but I credit my mic's beautiful sound to my mixer that I have. I have a Go XLR, PC Helicon Go XLR. This is why you're an O'Driscoll, O'Driscoll. You're out to survive. We're out to In my opinion, it's all on the EQ and compressor. Those are the two most important uh, effects, I guess. Dutch is more like a teacher. From where I've been, you just look the same as all. Then you looked, but you ain't seen. Okay, now, now cut left up here. We, we go down the hill into the forest. All right, down the hill we go. We're going in quiet. Taking them out as we find them. Trying not All right, so I guess we're going to have to do this stealthily, which I'm not very good at doing, but we'll find out here how it goes. There's a bull elk there. Okay, by me. With you, Morgan. All right, then. Through the trees here. I got caught in the back. I don't know why I'm moving so slow now. I guess I'm kind of going the same speed John is. Close. I'd leave your horses the other side of this clearing. I'll get my guns off my horse and I'm ready. Easy, Bill. Fine. All right, let's see here. I guess we're going to have to dismount momentarily. Do I know how long this game is? This is it. I've heard it's pretty long. I don't know exactly how long it is, but it's probably going to take a, several streams to play through it, for sure. Alright, let's see here. Okay, so I put my weapons already. That's good. I mean, Make sure I have my carbine repeater and my bow. Yeah, and I have my Calumon revolver. Alright, we're good. Am I throwing knives? Good. Okay. Pull those out. Follow me, alright? It ain't far. We might have shared a horse, but we ain't friends. Remember, I'm watching you every moment. I ain't gonna shop you now, come on. It'd be suicide. I think my sister, when she did the story mode, she had like... Lose your balls first. 17 or 18 streams that she did it. There, 
Over 40 hours, yeah, it's... It's a long one, but I'm excited to play through it. Okay. There's a camp yeah. here. Cabin's in the clearing down there. There'll be a bunch of fellers hiding out there, too. Are these fellas armed? Armed? Drunk? Wary of strangers, yep. Uncle Driscoll? Oh, he'll be holed up in his cabin. Be passed out, booze blind, likely as not. Hey, over there. Someone's coming. So, uh, who's gonna tell him we ain't got nothing for the pot? Oh, let me think. Tell her that spooked the game, I reckon. I'm gonna drain it. I I'll catch up. No, we ain't gonna pull Oh, this dude's sticking back. That's probably not good for him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If anyone's actually gonna shoot the messenger, it'd be that mean son of a bitch. Mm, yes, yeah, sir. Come on, take it off. What are we doing about the pisser, Morgan? One by the tree. Oh, Let's I, get closer. Get closer. I guess I've been told not to uh you know what's really quiet? to send people in to do this, but I'm gonna go ahead and send Bill in and hopefully that goes. Have I played the Rast Last of Us remake? I have not. No. I'm gonna go ahead and get my gun out because I have a feeling this is gonna go south very very quickly. All right, so now we got to take these two guys out. The next two. What's the plan? Let's do a ranged kill. Move, move. All right, I'll take this guy on the left. I can do that. We're here, waiting. here we go. This dude's sitting. Let's go ahead and have uh, John go in and get a kill. We gotta get everyone to get their hands dirty here. Oh, that was excessive. <laughs> Just jammed the knife in his throat three or four times. Uh, what am I doing here? Take the leader, send the gang. Uh, let's get to a gunfight. Time to move on. You ready? As I'll ever be. Let's go. How you doing? Here we go. That guy oh, didn't expect to kill him. I know I could use dead eye, but uh, I'm not a fan of dead eye. Guys already did. I need to care. Keep an eye on my health here. Cause I'm getting hit. I think he got shot. No, he's still alive. Now he's dead. These guys are hiding here. There we go. This dude's running. No survivors. I can hit him. There we go. Perfect. I'll check for survivors after I loot a little. Oh, I can't loot these guys. Please tell me it'll let me loot some of them. You got supplies? No, they won't. I can just run over them though. You ain't gonna check the cabin. I will. I'll check the cabin. I was just trying to loot. <laughs> All right, let me get my. I was gonna say my sidearm revolver, so I was trying to say those at the same time. It didn't work out too well. All right, here we go. How do I get in here? Can I go in this way? Nope. I want to go this way, game. Is there a door back here. I guess, uh, I guess I gotta go in through the door up front here, but it, there's no option to open it. Let's see. I have to blow it up. Go in through the, the top. 
Search the cabin. Well, it'd be great if I get into the cabin. There's nothing here. All right, we're gonna try this. I'm not sure if this is gonna work, but I plant dynamite on the door, maybe. Oh, there we go. Okay. <laughs> oh, rest in peace, buddy. You all right? Sure. Thank you. <laughs> Just got the door bashed in on me. You set us up. No, I didn't. You did. Homo Driscoll ain't here. He was here, I swear. I swear. I mean, if I was setting you up, I, I wouldn't have <laughs> saved your life. It's a good point, Arthur. All right, then. Go on. Get out of here. Hey? I won't kill you. No, I didn't set you up. Get lost. Shit, lost. I'm letting you run away. Better get no, running, dude. Get before Arthur That's changes his mind. Out there? Without you? Homo Driscoll's gonna lose his mind about this. <laughs> so? So I'm one of you now. <sighs> Give me a break. <laughs> All right, then. But I'm warning you. Oh, hey, I know. Come on, let's get to camp. So you got the cash, then? What cash? Yeah, there's usually some cash. <laughs> In the chimney. I'll check it. The rest of you boys, get to camp, quick. See, Arthur? I ain't so bad. <laughs> hey, Bill. You tell Dutch old Karen ain't worth killing. Just yet. <laughs> Right, you are. <laughs> All right, let's search the uh, the chimney. Well, actually, we search the whole cabin. There's a money clip here. There's the money. Probably have to share some of this with the camp. Yeah, it, this game truly does look beautiful on PC. I used to have, well, I, I still do have, I have a 4K monitor. Oh, here's a nice little rifle. Double barreled shotgun. Tempting. But I like my uh, carbine. I used to play this game in 4K before I upgraded my uh, my CPU. And I could barely get 60 FPS, but now that I have a better, uh, better PC, it's nice being able to run this game on, like, I don't have it on, like, high graphics like the max graphics i have the important graphics are very high but the rest of them i have some of them turned down oh there's a lockbox there okay is there anything else i can get here I'm kind of not paying attention to my screen right now so you take money yes i will take more money money's good a dollar is a dollar All right, there's a shotgun there. I don't need that. Let's search the nightstand here. Take some shotgun shells, sure. I don't have a shotgun. All right, that's gonna be everything. And then you said to search the chimney, but I mean, there's like there's nothing in the chimney. All right, and then there's stuff up on the I guess the second floor. But there's nobody to get up there, so unless I can jump. No, I'm gonna go ahead and just uh, let's see. Can we search this cabinet here? We can. Canned fruit. I'll take some more food for sure. There we go. There we go. Any other cabinets to search here? Nope. All right. Cool. Maybe the bed. Search the bed real quick. Okay, I think we're done here. Out we go. All the bodies here have been looted. Oh, there's one. There's a few over here that haven't been looted. Let's see if it'll let me loot them now. Return to the cabin. Am I supposed to get something from the cabin? How's it going, Josiah? And thank you, Jess. I can loot this guy. Oh, I think I know why I haven't seen it. I can't see it there.
Unless I have to like take the the shotgun. Uh, let's see. Oh, there it is. Search chimney. Very specific spot. At least you got something tucked away. Six hundred bucks. Take the shotgun. What gun am I? I don't want the shotgun. Maintain it. Okay. Well, that rust off of there. Dirt. Oh. All right. Gang share 300. I got 100. Um, I guess I'm getting rid of my bow, which I, I like using it for hunting, but oh well. Unless I can put stuff on the horse. Or unless it'll be on the horse. Let's see here. Oh, it's back on the horse. Okay, I'm stupid. Never mind. Okay, cool. Well, we did a mission. Let's see uh, what we're doing next here. I hate how long it takes to zoom out here. Okay, so closest mission that we can do is... This is probably closer. This is going to be... Leopold Strauss. This is for Thomas Downs. We have to go to another debtor. So we're going to go and head over that way here. Go do that. thought I completed that mission last time, but I guess there's this is a follow-up or something. Go ahead and ride on over there. Experience the beautiful landscape here. Got a nice mountain view. Stop for a second here and appreciate the beauty that is Red Dead Redemption 2. Absolutely stunning. I love it. Beautiful. Nice beautiful day in the game here too. Thank you, Jess. I never would have seen that. I would have been scratching my head for a while. Oh! Almost got run over. Hey. We are going through Valentine. I, need to pass. Howdy, you got a problem? I don't have a problem. I'm trying to move, but apparently my horse can't sprint through Valentine. Let's just go, and if I run someone over, I apologize in advance to anybody that gets in my way here. There we go. Almost like my sprint or my shift key is like not working. Either that or it's like limiting my speed here in the game. I don't know what's going on with that. I'm not going as fast as I was before. Is there like a particular reason why? There we go. Sort of. Oh, my horse didn't like that. Yeah, good boy. Do this while I'm moving. I can't. I'm probably going too fast. I was going to try to clean my horse, but. Hey, oh, I don't want to run into your. <laughs> I don't want to run into the wagon. I just wanted to say hi. So we have to go over here to this guy, I guess. Retrieve the debt from Mr. Downs. Alrighty, well, let's go ahead and retrieve some debt. He's in here in his garden. Uh, whatever do you want? Mr. Thomas Downs? You owe me money. Uh, oh, no, no, I'm, I'm, I'm... Oh, come here, you maggot. Please, sir. I'm... I'm... Oh, man. Threaten me, would you? Oh, please, I have a family, sir, please. You shouldn't have tried to beat me. Let's go ahead and threaten him. Believe me, sir. I didn't want this either. You ain't such a do-gooder, are you? 
See if I'll, uh... I'm, I'm not running anywhere. I'm, I'm... Come on, buddy. Give me what I need. You are a slippery little bastard. But I got you now. Please, please show some compassion. I've been showing compassion, man. I've been threatening you instead of punching you half the time. You saying he was right? What will that solve? Please. Okay, I took a couple punches and me being a little generous with him. You borrowed money from my business partner, Herr Strauss. You owe him, you took the money. He wants it back, what's not to understand? <laughs> oh, you spit blood all over him. There's our money. I don't have it. Sell your place. We already owe more than it's worth. Uh oh, here can people come out. Life, or your family or something. We ain't your idea of charity. Is that clear? <laughs> Thomas! What are you looking at? Thomas! I said what you looking at, woman? My husband isn't well. If we could just have more... Like I said, we ain't nobody's idea of charity. Get us the money. Husband isn't well. I guess Arthur's going back to camp. I don't have to do it myself. All right, I guess that's the mission. Now we have a little dot up ahead. Oh, this is the camp. Okay. A little dot. I'll clear my waypoint here when I'm done. I'm gonna hitch my horse. My horse wants to make up its mind where it wants to go. Okay, I'll just be stuck here, I guess. <laughs> my horse trying to get over to this side. There you go. All right, now I guess we're gonna go talk to someone over here, probably Dutch. Is this where I'm supposed to be? Yeah, on the other side. How's it going? What do you think of this place, Susan? An improvement on the last, that's for sure. Well, that ain't too hard. All right, well, I should be getting... Improvement on the last. Yeah, I'd say not being in the snow and, and blizzards is really good. But we're going to talk to Herr Strauss. That's where we're going, okay. Leopold Strauss. Just gonna like slowly, casually approach him. There we go. Ah, how did you get on? Not so good. He's almost dead. And they seem more or less destitute. You were a fool for lending them the money. Then, people who aren't desperate don't seem so interested in my propositions. Of course. All right, money lending and other sins mission complete. Go ahead and clear my waypoint. I guess we're gonna do uh we have a mission, I guess this is Dutch. So we'll go ahead and grab the mission from him, and then we'll uh do some of those other side missions. Wish we could sprint in the camp, it's annoying not being able to sprint. I think it's another thing of some someone's trying to talk to me. One of the girls saw that friend of yours, Mary Gillis, sniffing about. Mary Gillis sniffing about. Mr. Morgan. Funny business. Okay, thanks for telling me. Let me donate to the camp box here, even though that really doesn't do much of anything. Uh, give items. Is there anything I have in here I can donate? It would be worthwhile. I kind of want to sell all these myself. I'll donate one of them, though. I'm not going to do it in all four of them unless it absolutely does. No, I just did one. All right. There we go. It's some good karma for doing that. There's something over here, a note of some sort, I guess. Let's see. I don't need to shave right now. Inspect letter. 
Dear Arthur, I've written this letter a hundred times or more. Oh, it's Mary. I okay. It right. It's me. You know it's me from the bad handwriting. I know I said when we last spoke and I was going off to get married that we would not speak again. I know I said a lot of things and I meant them, I suppose, at the time. But I'm not so proud as to not speak to people who care for me or cared for me. I've been in Valentine for a couple of months. I had some bad luck and, well, it's a long story and not an interesting one. But I am here for now. I saw a couple of the girls, or whatever the polite term is for them, that ran with you and your associates in town. Hmm. And I heard tell of a man who sounded like you. I would love to see you again if you could spare me a little bit of your time. I'm renting a room at Chadwick Farm, just north of Valentine. Yours, Mary Linton. Okay. I don't know who Mary is, but I guess we'll find out. All right, let's talk to Dutch and see what he wants us to do. Arthur. Dutch? Miss O'Shea? Well, feels like we are finally getting back on our feet. You uh, find a buyer for them bonds we stole? Not yet, but Jose is working on it. When we heading west? Soon? I don't know. Feels like... Things have changed. The whole world's changed. They don't that seems like a very indecisive person. We're being hunted. We are smarter than them. Only the feeblest of men take jobs in the government. <laughs> I hope so. Trust Dutch, Mister. Some of his uh, his yeah, decisions he's made in the last few missions. Dutch, Arthur, what's going on? They got Micah. He. I don't like him. For murder. He was in Strawberry. It's okay, and... son. Breathe. <sighs> they nearly lynched me. They, they nearly they lynched Micah me. And the sheriff's in Strawberry. And there's talk of hanging him. Here's open. Arthur. What? <laughs> the fool brought this on himself. You know my feelings about him, Dutch. You think I can't see past his bluster to the heart inside? He is a fine man. No. I ain't saving that fool. I can't go. My face will be all over West Elizabeth. I am asking. He would do it for you. I don't think he would, but... I don't think he would either. You okay, Lenny? Yeah, of course I'm okay. You don't seem okay. You take that kid into town. Valentine, not Strawberry. Get him drunk. And Arthur? No crazy business. I'm giving that up. And you get Micah out of that jail. I guess we have to go save Micah. I'll get to it, Dutch. Just can't drop everything. An old Romeo. Ride to the Valentine's Saloon. So I guess we're going to the saloon. I can actually ride at my own pace here. It's so nice. I rode as fast as I could. Didn't stop for nothing. Yeah, you look like you've been through it. Sun is setting here. Looks absolutely beautiful. I love the sunset. Some following the the GPS. I kept asking him what we was doing, but he was you were I'm trying to take her out where I can watch the sunset. And look at it. Here we go. We can stop here briefly. Look at that red dead sunset. So beautiful. Then we ran into some fellas. One of them I could knew. Drink some more. And this is supposed to be a there we go. Absolutely two. beautiful screenshot there. I know how that goes. Well, let's go if we go in. Take one with G Force experience and let's continue on. Couldn't even tell you quite how. Happened like the strike of a match. The law was on us fast too. They was ready to strangle me up there and then. But I got away, just about. You're alright now. We'll take care of it. So you gonna go get him? I'll come with you. Uh, you leave it to me. For now, let's drink some. Forget about Micah. It was drank that drink and forget office. about Micah. Just have a cup. Oh, <laughs> he just got hit. I feel bad okay. for him, but I was trying not to hit him. I heard that impact. <laughs> we did get into a fight with Tommy. Oh, nothing big. No, we kept it clean. We're all good. 
If you say so, Arthur. Here we are at the saloon. Easy. Evening. Another fight? Is that what we're doing here? Let's find out. Go to the bar. In we go, just burst on in. I'm gonna come over here. Nope, it's not gonna let me. <laughs> I have to be like right here, I guess. Lean on bar, here we go. Just gonna squeeze our way in here. Just one or two, right off of course, just a drink. No big drama. Can we get a couple beers, please? You I don't want no trouble. You'll get none from me. I was defending myself. Tommy, he's... He'll be fine. Here, have one for yourself. Thank you. <laughs> Go ahead and drink a little bit of alcohol here. Micah seemed to know a lot of people. That was the problem. How you mean? I mean, I done seen a lot of crazy, crazy a stuff. A lot Mike... of crazy, crazy stuff. This you dude. Shut up. Will you shut up? Oh, we're gonna get into a little bit of a fight here. Oh, there, dullards! My lord, you men is dull. <laughs> oh, this guy's this guy's not getting away with this. Leave this fool alone. Leave the fool alone. People been leaving me alone for the. Next, I'm gonna charm him. Buddy, you're a charming fellow. I didn't realize I had an option to fight him or threaten him. <laughs> but me and the kid here, well, we're trying to talk business. So could you? Possibly leave us alone. No offense intended. Ain't no pleasing some folk. All right, he's he's walking away. He looks like he's drunk. He looks like he's drunk. Yeah. <laughs> Just one drink. <laughs> Here we are. Down in shots and beer bottles. Yep, Arthur's. Yep. Uh-oh. Where'd Lenny go? Lenny, where are you? Lenny! Hey, Lenny! Uh-oh. Lenny? Yeah. I'm afraid. You know where he went? Oh, I don't know if he just found that. He doesn't know where he is. Oh, he went upstairs. Okay. You know which way my friend went? Sorry, I don't know. Don't know? Okay, maybe this dude at the top of the stairs knows. Hey, you see my friend anywhere? I don't know. I don't know? Alright, I guess we're just gonna go look for him. Let's see if this guy knows the reason we'll talk to her. Or I'm not gonna talk to him? Okay. Not gonna talk to her either? Okay. Let's just go looking for him. Knock, knock. Anybody in here? Nope. Go the other side here. See if she knows. I don't have an option to talk to her. <laughs> All right, let's go find Lenny. What are you doing, Jet? Oh, he's over here. Well, I didn't mean to walk in on them. More alcohol. <laughs> no one would have me bouncing up and down. <laughs> uh oh, Lenny's gone again. Oh, Lenny's down there. Uh oh, I went the wrong way. I need to turn around. Lenny's in a fight. He's on the counter. He's going berserk down there. I gotta get down there and help him. I'm also very, very drunk. I kind of feel like Arthur's about to just like collapse and get. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> what the heck is going on? I'm expecting to get into a fist fight. Now I'm out here outside, just, you know, peeing to my heart's content. 
Yeah, because I've had like how many shots and how many beers. All right. Go back inside. I guess I'm in first person now. Find Lenny in the saloon. All right, we're gonna. Lenny, where are you hiding now? Is this Lenny here? Damn it, Lenny! Stop thumping off on me. Lenny? <laughs> Maybe you should switch to water, my friend. Lenny! <laughs> I've had a lot. What are you talking about? But here. <laughs> Is this Lenny here? You know. Sorry about that, Clyde. Yeah, I'm drunk as a skunk right now. Lenny's over here. Oh, let me go around. Oh, Lenny's over here too. This is this is great. I guess I should have to keep searching for him. Is this him over here? Let's go talk to this guy. I am drunk as a skunk right now. Oh. Here's Lenny. Oh, I slapped him. Oh, I just got slapped. <laughs> Ooh. It's like those Russian slap competitions right here. <laughs> I'm about to get blackout drunk. Oh, I just, just dropped the drink. Uh oh. What am I doing to this guy? I don't want to drown him. No. I ain't gonna drown him. <laughs> I What the heck is going on? This mission is insane. Oh, now he's vomiting. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, the sheriff. I'm just gonna run. I'm running this way. I don't know where I'm going, but all right, I guess I just finished that part of the mission. That was insane. Wasn't expecting to go to a bar and get like blackout drunk. Have things happen. <laughs> and now we are laying in the dirt. Because sometimes that happens when you get drunk. You wake up in the middle of nowhere. Arthur's like... <laughs> you moron. Not again. Not again, Arthur. Oh, there we go. Uh-oh. <laughs> Oh, I didn't realize there was this thing on here. Let's let's read this. March 1898, Ellie and Alfred, always in my heart. All right, I need to eat something. Pretty sure I have some uh, some nice cooked meat here. We got a plain venison. Let's go and eat that. There we go. Cure that right up. All right, where am I in relation to where I was? Okay, well, <laughs> I was in Valentine. Now I'm in the middle of nowhere down here. Flat next station, so. Can my horse find me? No, my horse cannot find me. Or can it? Stamina core is empty. My stamina core is not empty. That horse don't listen. I'm too far away from my horse, I think. Let me run back down here. Um, help. Where is my horse? My horse is all the way back in Valentine. Are you serious? Do I have to run all the way back to Valentine to get my horse or 
I might just honestly steal a horse as much as I don't want to do that. Let's go see if we can find an unsuspecting passerby and I'll borrow their horse temporarily. I don't want to steal a horse, but you know, I also don't want to run all the way back to Valentine. Where's the closest road to here? Holy cow, I'm going the wrong way. This is now Jogging Simulator. Rockstar Games presents Jogging Simulator. I need to stop and let my energy replenish here. Hydrate or dehydrate. All right, we made it to the road. Now we need to wait for someone to walk by. And I can take their horse. Unless I have a horse, I can pick up a horse for this mission. I don't know though. Well, this dude need help over here. Might as well help him real quick. It looks like he just got out of jail. Yeah, he just escaped from jail. I've been on the run for days now. If you could help me with these shackles, I just I know that I just talked about committing a crime, but you serious? Shoot the damn chains already. Come on. I ain't gonna shoot damn chains. Just shoot the chains off, please. I'm done for otherwise. I ain't gonna shoot the chains off, no. I mean, do I have to shoot the chains off, I guess? No. Oh. Oh, I guess I get positive honor serious. for helping him. Perfect. I didn't realize that, okay. Mm -hmm. I, I got no money to give you, but I think I might got something even better. Even better? Some of those fellows talked about this old crone up north of Strawberry. Got herself a tidy sum locked away. Ooh, a Maybe just burglary story. job. They were sure excited. Oh yeah. Why'd I be a robbery that, tip. Huh? Okay. Um, I don't know, just a hunch. Up Go ahead and hold F1 for details. I still haven't found Dutch a pipe. There is a home robbery. Okay, well, seeing as we are a gang and we, you know, steal to take money. Alright. Your horse is out of whistling range. Yeah, I know that. I need to find a horse. I don't know if there's going to be one here, but... And I figured there might be, since this is by a... Uh, a railroad. Might as, let's start this mission, see if it'll give me a horse. I don't know, though. Reverend Swanson. How's it going, Biddy? Welcome. Reverend! Here we go. Mr. Morgan. I took your advice, sir. I took your advice. Then your god has finally deserted you. What you talking about? I took your advice, sir. I have removed myself from Morpheus's embrace. No more shall I sink, sir. I am free. I am free. <laughs> you don't seem free, friend. You seem drunk. I was about to say, it sounds like he's drunk. You ain't finished. Look at him, he's finished. None of us force liquor down his throat, friend. I just want him to play. Now, firstly, we ain't friends. Don't make no mistake on that subject. Now, secondly, he can't hardly see, let alone reason. Now, reasoning ain't never been one of my strong points, neither. But seeing, I do just fine. You want to step outside? Dean, you, you didn't do good seeing last night, Arthur. You got drunk. Why can't we all just get along? He's a good <laughs> man, Arthur. There's children of God. I have children of God. He's gonna drunk or high or something. Well, how's about you playing this place, huh? That seems fair. Fair? Sure. You want a game? Do I want to play or do I not want to play? Let's give it a shot and see how bad I am at this. Play a few hands. Well, sit yourself down then. I'm Luther. This is Marvin. Fortunate for you both for being gentlemen about this. Same goes for you. So, how you two know each other anyway? Don't seem like a lock best of friends, if you don't mind me saying. I don't know what I'm doing. A long way back. And now you're his chaperone. 
Uh, let's see. Something like that. Can we play? <laughs> I have no idea. He can't a promising him. starting hand. He committed about five cardinal sins just in that chair. Let's go ahead and raise six cents. Why not? He used to be. He's drifted a little in recent years. Life is a challenge to all of us. Can you imagine him at the pulpit? If he could stand up. On the fourth day, he turned water into whiskey, and I don't remember much. Seven, queen, eight. <laughs> I, don't, I have no idea how to do this. Who's very able to play poker? I'm, <laughs> I'm, I'm terrible at playing poker. I've played it like time. once. Disrespect him again, and you'll find yourself in a bad I'm going to check. Too. All right, all right. Just trying to have a little fun here. It is a game after all, mister. Take my turn. Got seven, eight, queen, ace. My turn. I don't, I don't know what to do here. <laughs> this is confusing. Sure, let's go up. I know. That ain't too exciting. Jesus, you play like my grandmother. You got a final round of betting. Got ten, ace, seven, queen, eight. Um, hmm. Sometime before we all grow. If I want to bet aggressively. Oh, I'm gonna go eight cents. I don't know. I'm a play slow. These guys are just gonna keep going. They're just gonna keep going in. <laughs> oh, here. This ain't what you call finishing strong. Not looking good. Come on. Darn it. Uh, yes. Oh, Arthur won. Cool. <laughs> I get to play again. Hold the escape at any time. To I'm, I'm not going to play anymore. I'm really bad at this. Gentlemen, this is getting too rich for me. Well, sit down. Oh, I'm done. <laughs> it's been a real education. Getting my poker education on Red Dead Redemption. Where is he? Where'd he go? Who? The Reverend. Where it? <sighs> Excuse me, gentlemen. Reverend. Reverend Swanson. Where'd you go? All right, we gotta find him. These guys aren't gonna talk. Let's question them here. Excuse me, I'm sorry. You, you see a drunken idiot, priest wandering about? Sure, we saw him, smelt him, and <laughs> saw him, smelt him, and avoided him. <laughs> he went that way, I think. Thanks. Guy looked kind of crazy, Mister. <laughs> I know it. <laughs> you have no idea. I was about to say. Okay, my horse got magically teleported here. Awesome. That's what I like to see. Hey! Back to work, boy. All right, here we go. What is he doing? What the heck? Uh-oh. Nope. I'm getting into it, man. That is attacker? Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and give him a few punches. There we go. Just Did I kill him? Front of the witness. Can I not use my horse? What? There's sheep here, cool. Alright, let's go and use this to the old fashioned way. You better stop right there. Stay away from me. I said stop, damn it. Okay. There we go. Okay. Please. Threaten him. What you saw back there? You're dead. I'm I'm such a nice criminal. Yep. I I won't tell a soul. Damn right you won't tell a soul. Oh, I got an <laughs> Wait, I killed him? What? Uh oh, Reverend's about to get run over by a train, I feel. This is not good. 
This is not good at all. Can I get up over here? I can. Reverend's kind of dumb. With the heat waves over there. It doesn't show the temperature in the game like it does in uh just a simple mistake. You can still be saved. Get on my horse here. Can I get on my horse? Nope. Okay, just hang out here before me. <laughs> oh dear, I hear a train. I I need to run. I need to hurry here. Dilly dallying probably wasn't a smart decision. Not at all. How do I help him? Oh, I got a click. Ooh. Ooh. I hope my horse got off. Oh my god, my horse got off the track. Okay. Ooh, crisis averted. Ooh. I didn't mean to kill those guys. I just, just wanted to beat some sense into them. You throwing me off a bridge like there that? There was a goddamn train, you crazy bastard! <laughs> Have I been bad again, Mr. Morgan? I'm sorry. Uh, I wish I was different. <laughs> Let's get you home. Home. Yeah. That's, That's a wonderful, wonderful idea. <laughs> I could have tea with Margaret. Margaret, who's Margaret? But oh, and then he's gonna faint. All right, let's get him home. No idea where he lives, but all right. Horseshoe overlook. Take him to the camp. Hang on tight, Reverend. We're going for a ride here. I like the heat waves. It's so good. Just a little, little thing like that that makes this game just so much more immersive. Love it. Oop, I am not paying attention to where I'm going. I was looking at my other monitor. Close the drapes. Like Lenny there. Here we are back at the camp. Hitch your horse. Well, where's their hitching post? Is there a hitching post over here? There is over here. My horse doesn't want to go over there. Will it go this way? It's very hesitant to go this way for some reason. I don't know why, but... Come on, horse. Go. There we go. Let's remove Reverend Swanson. I was wondering when he'd show up. When he'd show up. Yeah, well, we're just gonna. How's it going, Dutch? You're working out, Dutch. You always do. Thank you, Arthur. I should have known. Get that fool back to his tent to sleep it off. <laughs> just walking, carrying the reverend on my shoulder. All right, let's put him in his bed over here. You better sleep your way to salvation, my friend. <laughs> what happened? Just. The usual. Poor oh. bastard. Exactly. Well, <laughs> thank you, Mr. Morgan. I'll keep an eye on him. He was lucky this time. Was lucky this time. He had someone's fist in his face there. All right, another mission complete. Who is not without sin? All right, let's see. What's uh, what's our next mission that we're doing? I'm gonna zoom all the way out here. We gotta go. Emerald Ranch, who's this going to be? This is with uh, Hosea Matthews. 
Needs help with a new business opportunity at Emerald Ranch. Uh, let's see. That's a, let's see, that's a little far. We got Mary up there. We can go talk to her. We have Javier. Micah. Uh, let's, let's see here. Let's, let's go free Micah. Let's, I feel like that's a very critical part of the story that we need to go do. So we're going to go free Micah real quick. Just, you know, speed walk, power walk over here. This is the eighties. We'll power walk. All right, let's go ahead and set my waypoints down here to strawberry. All right. Onwards of victory we go. Yeah. Oops. My uh, camera back where I like it. And let's uh, follow the global positioning system. Got strawberry. Nice, beautiful ride out here. Looks like it's going to rain. The weather is much different in story mode than it is in online. Most of my time playing this game has been in the online environment, so. A companion activity is available in the camp. Talk to companions marked on your map to join in. Do I have to talk to people in the camp to do this? Is that what I'm supposed to do? I'm just going to go over there and, you know, if I have to do this myself, I do it myself. Scare whale the fish for that poor guy trying to fish there. Nice ride through the wilderness here. I want to send my horse is level three bonding now. Either that or it's getting close to level four. I need to get a better horse. This is like the first horse that you can buy when you have to get a horse. So I might uh I might try to get another one at some point. Maybe I'll do that next stream. Maybe I'll do it off stream and just record it, put it on YouTube. I don't know. Figure it out, but I need a better horse than this one. I've heard there's some pretty beautiful horses you can get here in story mode. Yeah. I'm going to slow down here a little bit. The horse regains some of its stamina. Nice pace here. Yeah, sun's going down here. Absolutely beautiful. I love this game's graphics. It looks so good. Looks amazing. I hope you guys are having a fantastic Friday night so far. Hope you had a good week as well. If you guys have any weekend plans, you feel free to put it in the chat. And this dude over here is asking for help. Okay, what's up, buddy? I'm in bad sorts here. I took a little jolt and I managed to get myself hopelessly lost. I am staying in Strawberry. If you could just guide me back. You're in luck, buddy. I'm heading to Strawberry right now to break my uh, break my friend out of prison. Hop up there on on the back with you. Your legs work, don't they? Well. Yes, I suppose. It's just a little demeaning. I'm going to get him on the back of my horse. Does it not give me an option? What are you doing out here anyway? It clearly ain't your natural habitat. I want to I want to put him on my horse. I, uh, no, I'm just visiting. While I'm doing this, Carol, I can brush uh, my horse. New York City, actually. It'll let me. Nope. Okay. Ugh, I'm done with this. Find your own damn wife. Okay. What? No, you horrible man. I was trying to help him. I thought the decline was to not let him ride on my horse. This game is very poor in how it tells you to do things. If you won't help, at least have the decency. I'm trying to help you, dude.
Okay, well, that was... I was <laughs> I wasn't trying to do that, buddy. I was trying to help you. Yeah. And it's now getting dark and foggy out. Yeah, cool. Okay. Well, uh, back on the road we go to Strawberry here. Lesson learned: let the uh, the dialogue finish before making a choice. I guess. Oh, that guy's riding in the middle of the road. Man, this looks really really good here. All this fog. Here's Strawberry. These kids' birthday party. Oh, nice. Gonna go hang out with Mandy. Hope you have a good time at church. My overtime got reduced again, so probably won't be working this weekend. But anyway, here we are. And Strawberry at the jail. More like hanging out with the kiddos. I guess you're the quote unquote babysitter. Let's go ahead and uh, go on in here. Knock, 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 knock. Yep. Hello, sir. I've uh, I've come from Blackwater. I'm on the trail of a dangerous gang. <laughs> I'm on the tail of a dangerous gang. Heard you had some sort of incident. We don't deal with bounty hunters around here, son. I, I was just wondering if I could get a description. Well, they weren't friends. They got in a fight, two men got killed. Now, one of them's an idiot, the other's some kind of dumb mick, so maybe them's your boys. You can look right enough when we hang them. Thank you, Sheriff. Being around me because I talked to them a lot. Yeah, that, that makes sense. They probably also like as you play games with them. Alright, let's figure out where Mike is here. Let's see. By one of these windows here. Here we go. Arthur! Arthur! Hello, old friend. I should have antagonized them. I don't like Mike. I ain't decided yet. Real funny. Oh, I ain't joking, cowpoke. I heard so much bluster out of your mouth these last six months, and now I got an opportunity to watch you be silenced. Well, you gotta do something. Why? I always looked up to you, Arthur. Well, that's your first mistake. <laughs> Listen, there's one little problem. There's only one of me, and there's a whole town full of people wanting to see you swing. You got to do something, Arthur. I gotta do something, huh? Find a way to free Micah. I do I have dynamite? I do have dynamite. You might want to step back a bit. I guess I'm breaking Mike out right now. Is this is this what we're doing here? This wall just needs some good force. Grab hook. Or maybe I could use this. Yes. Hook that over the okay, <laughs> it's it's a little bit less loud than uh dynamite what a modern disaster this is going to be. I don't think it's gonna work out very well come on right, we're gonna give this a shot trampoline park, trampoline park. sounds like fun I think gonna blow oh well there we go I stand corrected. Let's get out of here. Come on. Oh, damn. No Driscoll. I'm now wanted again. Get right in front of him. Here we go. I quit my bandana. Where's the other? That's a criminal. Don't go 
Gotta go over this way. Okay. Shooting here. Sorry, I was distracted there for a second. We loot these bodies? No, we can't. Oh, we can. Can't really do anything about that right now, though. Kind of hard to see in the dark here, but. There we go. Four shots to kill someone. Or we just shoot him in the head. Skinny. Oh man. Uh-oh, that dude just opened the door and got shot. Okay. Oh, Mike is a real piece of... Oh. Mike is a real piece of dirt. Look at that. Oh, his guns. Nice. All right, we need to get out of here. I'll just shoot him five times to kill him, no biggie. I think I need to clean this. Oh, I'm about to like die here. Where are we going, Micah? Make up your mind. Holy cow. Ooh. Nope, 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 nope. We need to, need to eat some uh, some venison here. Good lord. Micah's gonna die over there. And I'll take this double barreled shotgun. I need to let my, my health core recharge here. I ain't giving up on you, dude. I'm trying to, dude. My horse, get on my horse. Let's go, yeah, go horse. Evade the law by escaping from the red search area. Well, that's what I'm trying to do. All right, let me do this. I like having my. I don't want the double barreled shotgun. I want my carbine repeater. There we go. I didn't expect to make that shot. Yeah, the red search area. They just keep spawning in here. I'm trying to get away from them. I didn't mean to shoot the horse there, but oh well. There we go. Oh, I guess Micah died. My horse died. Oh no. All right, I guess I'm gonna use dead eye a little bit more here. Try from the checkpoint. All right, come on horse, let's go. Did he kill both of them? He did. Micah seems to be doing more work than I am here, so maybe I'll just let him do all the killing. Yeah, he just killed both of them. So I guess I'm just gonna let Micah do all the work here. There we go. Cool.
I'm going faster than you are, Micah. That was some good shooting, Morgan. Oh, he just ran into me. I guess I did it by myself. I wonder if I was supposed to take other people with me, but. Making a house call in the middle of all that ain't much I care about more than those guns. That much is clear. Who was that fella? Skinny? Yeah. We ran together for a while. Did a bank job down south. Didn't end well. A little backstory is always nice. Goddamn ended. He was gonna let me hang. I'm starting to wish I had. And you owe Lenny, too. He hadn't found us in time. Yes, you will all be thanked profusely. I promise. If I can yeah, speed this up a little bit. And just there we go. Dutch has got your back. Some unknown reason. Cutscene. I think we finally lost him. I hope so. I'm giving you a holster. It's my way of saying thank you. And thank you. Giving me a holster. There I was having a dull day only for you, to liven it up by letting me help you shoot up half a town. <laughs> You're a funny fella, Arthur. Real funny. <clears throat> why you act all sour all the yeah, time? Yeah, well, you ain't funny at all. So why you gotta act like the court just right, listen? <laughs> this is bickering back and forth like they're an old married couple. <laughs> Arthur, you and me, sons of Dutch, makes us brothers. <clears throat> Sometimes. Yeah, I don't like Micah. Make mistakes. I don't like Micah. I don't like Dutch. Dutch can be a little... He can be pretty motivational sometimes, but it's... I get a feeling like it's going to be, like, very repetitive. Got to hype everyone up and then just over and over again. I can bring him a peace offering. Bye now. Yeah. And there goes Micah. We just rescued him from prison and he's off. Now own the offhand holster. This allows you to carry two sidearms at once and to wield them. Interesting. That's good. First and foremost, before I do anything, let me see if I can clean my, uh... Oh, I, I have both of them dual-wielded already. I was going to say I, I need to clean my gun. I need to clean my repeater. Do I have any more gun oil? I do. Clean my repeater here. There we go. Perfect. All right, we did another mission. Let's go ahead and open up the map and see where our closest story mission. It's going to be uh, Javier down here. So let's go ahead and circle our way down there and head over there. We are currently wanted in Strawberry. We probably can't put foot foot. Can't, Kurt probably can't step foot in Strawberry for a hot minute here. And my horse is refill slower when it's for health core is low. Well, I'm trying to get horse's health core back up. Go ahead and brush him here. I'm a carrot. How's it going, Hassan? Welcome. Glad you could uh, join for the stream here. Let's go ahead and skedaddle on down here and help Javier out with the mission he has. It's probably going to take me the long way around here. Oh. Wolves, I ain't going to deal with them. I'm just going to keep running here. Going the wrong way here. I guess I have to wait. Oh, the train's already passed. Cool. This dude just walking down here. There's a light. He moved over. I didn't expect him to. Nice little trip through here, through the woods. Beautiful night out here. Black water in the surrounding areas in lockdown, shown by red air and the pause menu. Pause map. You'll become wanted if seen by the law in this area. Just, uh, I just wanted to get through here. 
Oh, I'm just gonna... I'm getting away from you guys. I know I'm wanted dead or alive, but... Oh! My horse just made that jump. That was good. These guys are gonna keep chasing me, huh? They're, they're gonna get shot. Just trying to get over here. Do I have to go... It looks like it's just north of Blackwater. I'm just trying to get over here, but... I gotta figure out how to get away from these guys. I guess... Well, here we go. I didn't want to do this, but I guess I have to. I'm done. Because I put a bullet in your face. Well, my horse is... I kicked off my horse because my horse got a little too, uh... My horse needs to be revived. Nice shot there. Nice. Okay. I'm sorry, horse. I don't have a horse reviver. What? I don't have an option to revive my horse. Are you serious? I don't have an option to revive my horse. What? What kind of... Conundrum did I get myself into here? You know what? I'm just gonna leave my horse. I'm gonna run on foot. I did not ask for this, and yet it is still happening. The law over here. I'll steal one of the law's horse. Horse deaths are permanent sorry mode, so my horse is dead, basically. Alright, well, I'll take this thoroughbred. This is my new horse. Thank you, law enforcement, for giving me, uh... Endless waves of the law. Well, I'm trying to get away from him here. How's it going, Phantom? Welcome. Glad you can make it. How am I supposed to do this then, Jess? Because I have to go there for Javier. These lawmen are on my ass here. I need to really get ahead of them. He's he's tired. They lo I lost them. I think though for now. Shoreline on the other side. Okay. Well, unfortunately, my horse died, which is sad. But we'll make this our new horse. Let me uh, give my horse uh, got some carrots. Totally not playing uh, Red Dead Redemption Two. I'll watch you play Red Dead Two. <laughs> it's addicting. I think I'm on Chapter Two, Phantom. I need to eat something here. Let me eat some peaches. Name the new horse. I will name the new horse. Do I have to take it to a stable to do that? I think I do. Alright, so it's on the shoreline on the other side. Okay. Let's see, how am I gonna do this? Where am I at? I need to go a little bit east. And then cut south. I'll, I'll get over here. I need to get to a stable. Where's the closest stable? Blackwater is the closest stable probably, but I can't do anything about that. I think there's one near Strawberry as well, but I'm... This is a really tough spot here. I think I need to put this horse and get this horse owned before I can do anything with it. Or is this like, quote unquote, my horse now? I don't know how it works in story mode. Start patting them, they start pooping. <laughs> All right, let's see here. Micah annoys you? Yes, Micah annoys me too. I just rescued him and then shot up most of Strawberry and then he left. I have to go to the stable? Okay. Um, well, I'm going to go ahead and take a little uh, intermission. We're going to head over towards Strawberry. There we go. Can see my the red is so hard to see. Yeah, see my horse is uh you know where's my horse? My horse is right here. <laughs> it's dying in the field. It got shot apparently. 
So uh, I'm gonna go take this horse and make this my horse. Let me cross the railroad track here before the train. It's very loud, holy cow. Yeah, so this is gonna be my new horse. I haven't decided what I'm gonna name it yet. It's a thoroughbred, so I guess that's good. Actually a beautiful horse, I like it. Every time I see my uh, my horse on the map, I think it's another player. I'm so used to online seeing other players. I'm like, oh boy, here we go. I'm about to deal with someone. It is a pretty horse, yeah. Stop slowing down. I'm not putting you in front of the wagon to get you run over horse. It's okay. I'm not that cruel of a person. Go ahead and slow down and let my uh, energy restore here. Yeah, so my horse died. Or it's dying, I should say. And uh, Your leg's trapped? Well, let me see if I can get down there and help you, buddy. Watch him be like, take me to Strawberry. I'll be like, no can do, sir. I'm wanted there. I will get shot as soon as I walk in. Let's go help this guy out here. What I like about story mode is you have these little events. Oh yeah, your leg is trapped. It's stuck in a... Oh boy. How's it going? Looks terrible. I'm Cosmo. It's real bad. All right, let's go and disarm the trap then. I don't got no time here. Keep Open up that trap. There we go. God, you did it. Praise Jesus. Oh, God. He's gonna like, grab something for, for the blood. <laughs> Hopefully, he's using a tourniquet for that. Because <laughs> the wound looks like it's further down on his leg. Take something. Take some pistol cartridges. Sure, why not? Rifle cartridges. Nice. All right, glad I could help you there, buddy. Is the horse cores are pretty bad. I need to. I need to help this horse. Give it something to eat here. Let's give him a wild carrot. Unless the cores were bugged there, but anyway, I need to get some more, uh, some more wild carrots. There's level one horse bonding achieved. It's good that I'm bonding with this horse because this is my horse now. <laughs> I can no longer use local shops. Is that, oh, what? I literally got here and it's like, you can't use the stable. Okay, well, um, do I need to like pay my bounty or something? Okay, let's pay my bounty. Where, where can I do that? Rig station, probably? Let's go to rig station, shall we? Back and forth, back and forth. Here we go. Micah ruined that? Yeah, Micah's a real piece of work, and there's the law right there. Careful here. What's gonna happen is I'm gonna like, walk right into the law. I'm gonna have to be careful. I think they'll probably be posted up closer to cities, though. And I just ran over some animal. Yep, rest in peace. Yeah, okay, hopefully my bounty isn't too much. I've made a little bit of money. I spent some time earlier today when I was, uh, wasn't working. Spent some time playing and just doing camp stuff. And I made a little bit of money for myself, so it shouldn't be a problem paying off my bounty here. Besides, I'm probably going to get a bounty playing in the game. And of course, this is... Is this locked too here? Just going to run on in here. How's it going, sir? Happy to assist you in a moment. Pay my bounty. One crook raised so much hail. New hand over? Yeah, I'll pay $10 to clear my bounty. I have 250 bucks. I've got money. I've got money. I'm good. Why does the core show as like zero? Is that my core? Oh no, that's my my horse's core. Okay. I'm sitting here trying to figure out what the heck's going on with it. Alright, so I don't have a bounty anymore. Can I go near Strawberry? I can still cannot go near Strawberry, but at least I should be able to go to the stables, hopefully. Let's find out.
Take a nice scenic ride through here. It's your horse that's dying. Yeah, I kind of figured it was my horse that was dying in the field. Maybe I should go and kill it and just put it out of its misery. I don't know if it'll let me take this one before I do that. I guess we'll find out. Surprised it hasn't died yet. They don't have anyone posted up over here. That's good. The stables are just up over the, the ridge here. Careful I don't run this horse out of energy too. The stables are still locked. Okay, well, I guess I'm kind of like screwed for now. Okay, well, I guess I gotta wait for a bit before I can use the stables here. There's no other stables I can go to, is there? Zoom, 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 zoom. I could go, let's see. And go to Valentine. I mean, I could go to Valentine, but. Probably not in West Elizabeth, I'd imagine. Um, There's a stable all the way over there. This is just the <laughs> back and forth simulator. I was going to go help Javier over here, but I guess we're not going to do that. We're going to go to Hosea after we go to this stable here. Yeah. All right, on the road we go again. On another adventure. Once we get this horse situation resolved, I'll probably take a brief little break. Five, ten minutes. Get some more water. Grab a little snack. I, oh, I just ran I just ran over another animal. I don't even see what I'm running over. I must be running over like squirrels or chipmunks or something. Oh, this horse is not happy with me. Okay. You're alright, boy. You're alright, boy. Let's go to casual pacer. I can also open up cinematic mode and use that, but uh I'm more just, you know. Rolling here. PS is very kind and has informed me that I've dropped. I haven't dropped too many frames. It's probably dropping frames because of my network. My network isn't uh, isn't the best, unfortunately. We can go ahead and pick up the pace again here. Oh, I've red dots on my screen. Is that the law? I hope not. I'm just going to keep running here. That's good. It's been looking okay. Plenty of opportunity here for... Hunting. I don't know where I'm supposed to go because this whole area is white up here. I guess this is... I'm going to go to the right here. This is probably some type of event that was foreshadowed prior in the last stream and I've just forgotten about it because I don't have a good memory. Oh, I'm not paying attention to my horse. I'm going to go and calm him down here. Good boy. I'm going to be really upset if I get over to this stable and then the game's like, yeah, this one's closed down too. At that point, I'm just going to be like, all right, I'm just going to take this horse and probably clean this horse. I've been running with it for a little while here. Slow down. Ooh, having trouble. Just slow down to a walk here. There we go. This actually is a really nice horse. I like this.
So if you're just tuning in, uh, my horse was, uh, you know, tragically shot by blah, 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 while I was trying to get to Javier. And uh, I stole this horse from them and I'm trying to make it mine because as Jess told me a little bit ago, horse deaths are permanent in uh, story mode. So my, my first horse that I bought, unfortunately, has uh, crossed the rainbow bridge. Well, according to the game, it's still sitting in a field near Blackwater. So I'm just going to hope that it uh, passes away and I don't have to go back and kill it because that would be tragic. There's a lot of deer over here. I wish I could like set up a camp and a little bit of hunting. I might need to replenish my venison. I think I have like one venison left or something like that. Source doesn't have very large stamina bar, so. Easy boy. Easy boy. See, how much further do I have to go here? I'm not too far. Got a little bit of a distance here. Need to explore the beautiful landscape of New Hanover. Absolutely stunning here. Beautiful. Blue sky, sunny day. I'm gonna turn right here. I'm just gonna go ahead and take a little shortcut. My waypoint isn't exactly on the, the stables. Oh. Did not want my horse to go there at auto path there. Across through the fields here, should be just past the trees. There's the stable. There we go. Okay. Please tell me this one's open. This one looks like it's open. Okay, here we go. In we go. You lose your saddle, it'll be able to retrieve for you when entering the stables. Well, I technically lost it. It is a fine steed. I would like to transfer my uh Sorry, but without the papers, I can't pay you full price. That's great. I'm trying to How much does it cost a stable? I guess There we go. Saddle up. Okay. I guess I still have a Tennessee Walker. There we go. All right. Well, let's see. What kind of upgrades can we buy for this horse? Even though it's probably going to die eventually. Probably want to get a better saddle. It's how much this one is stock. $51. That's honestly not bad for, for a stable or for a stable for a, uh, a saddle. Maybe get a reviver. That is a really good idea. Jess. Let's focus on that services. Horse care package. Should we buy a horse care package? No, I don't need that. Services. I need equipment. Came to the right shop today. That I um, there's going to be tack. Let's see. Tack and services. There we go. Or is it? No, it's horse provisions. Let's buy a. Uh, let's buy some more. We can't buy any more hay because we can only carry three. I probably have to upgrade my uh. Let's go ahead and just buy out some some food here. Uh, horse survivor, that's what we need. Nine fifty. Let's buy three of them. Okay. Uh, we can avoid having another issue, but I guess is this technically my horse now? Like I don't know how it works, honestly. I guess this is my horse. I haven't named it, have I? I probably need to do that. Or two or three, yeah. <laughs> morning I can't talk to the stable owner I can only aim my weapon at him uh, let's see if we can name the source if it'll let me let's try to find out then we can go do some story missions I've been yep this is my horse now let's see here uh, thoroughbred 
Equipment? Nope. Appearance? Nope. Services? Rename horse. Alright, we can finally name our horse. I'm not entirely sure what to name this horse. It's a male, I know that much. And, uh, yeah. It's a beautiful horse, though. Let's think here. I should I name it? There's, there are some suggestions in the comments for me, guys. What do you guys think I should name this horse? I'm absolutely terrible at naming horses, so... Bullseye like Toy Story? That's a good suggestion, Jess. Brago? That's also a good suggestion. I like Brago. Can always change it. I'll go with Brago. Brago's a good name. I like that one. Huh. Really? Really? This guy's like shocked that I named my horse that. <laughs> All right, so we have Brago here. We're gonna try to keep Brago alive as long as we can. All right, now we're gonna go ahead and move up here, and we're gonna go with Hosea. They, I guess, a business opportunity or some type of land opportunity here. But let's take uh, take Brago. Let's go ahead and eat some apricots here. Let's restore my cores a little bit. I need to go to a general store somewhere. Somewhere that I'm not wanted. I need to get some more... Uh, some more food. Or I need to hunt and kill. You know what we're going to do? We're going to take a brief intermission again. Uh, we're going to do a little bit of hunting here. I'm just going to... See if I can wait for this guy to stop moving. I'm, I could probably shoot it with my rifle, but I like using my bow. There we go. Those, I thought those other ones didn't hear me for a second there, but we'll go ahead and hunt this real quick and we'll cook it. Get some, uh, some venison off of it here. Let's go ahead and, uh, go and skin. Make a little camp here. Just hold on there, boy. <laughs> Just hold on there, boy, as I'm skinning this thing. There we go. Got a poor pronghorn hide. Four mature venison meat. Nice. Let's go ahead and stow this on the horse. Make a little camp here real quick. Middle of a field. Perfect place to make a camp. All right. Let's do some cooking, shall we? Clean venison. That's all we need right now. Go ahead and stow all these. I'll probably eat the last one. Be the second of four. Does meat in my in my uh, satchel go bad? Does anybody know? Like, oh, that was the last one I can cook. Like, uh, for example, if I have like raw meat in my satchel. Do I have to cook that ASAP and eat it? Because I know that carcasses can go bad. Make some thyme venison. Make a thyme venison. Why not? Only if it's on the horse? Okay. Go eat that thyme venison. Yum yum. Okay. Uh... Let's go ahead and sleep here real quick. I'm actually gonna, I'm gonna take my little break. I need to go to the bathroom and grab a little snack. So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, take a short break, five, 10 minutes, and uh, I will catch you guys here shortly. So I'll see you guys then.
Brady. Apologize for the uh, extended wait there, guys. We're going to go ahead and jump back into this. Go ahead and... Uh, let's see. How long can we sleep for? I wish we could have a little more customization in how long we sleep for. But we're going to go ahead and sleep until it's nighttime. And then we're going to go do a mission. Hopefully you guys are able to use the bathroom, grab a drink, grab a little snack while you're waiting. Here we are. It is nighttime. Let's go ahead and pack up camp. Or it's going to force me to be on the bedroll there. Go ahead and put our camp out here. And let's get on Brego, my newest addition, because my other horse died. Rest in peace, Romeo. And, uh, oh, I already had my thing waypointed over here to Hosea. So let's go ahead and go do another mission here. I'm going to go ahead and just go directly towards him because it's going to put me on the road. Let's get on running. Beautiful night here. Hopefully there's no one in this town that wants to be dead. So find out. I guess this is him here. Yep. I never word with him. Uh, no doubt. I do interest in very well. It's trusting. I don't do so well. Please. Right, this is Seamus. He's our new partner. I ain't no such thing. Prospective new partner if he <laughs> likes us. Liking ain't the problem. Trusting is, as I said. Keep your voices down. I don't want my boss hearing. This is a sideline. Of course. Look at us. Honest as the day is long. Exactly. I'll tell you what. Let us prove ourselves. <laughs> prove ourselves? <laughs> this clown? What you talking about? Good day, Hosea. Good luck with your business dealings. Listen, uh, he's rough and ready and quick with his tongue, but I swear you can trust him and trust me. I'm an old man. <laughs> Arthur over here running his mouth. Old enough. And you know why I ain't dead? You don't trust idiots. Exactly. We're not don't trust idiots. idiots. Let us prove it to you. Okay. I'll tell you what. Arthur. Old Bob Crawford and his boys just bought a beautiful stolen stagecoach from upstate. It's Ooh. in their barn. Now you go get that. And then we can work together. Who's old Bob Crawford? An acquaintance of mine. So you want us to take out your competition? Well, he, he's not just an acquaintance, but a cousin. Ooh. A marriage. I also want to see if you boys got what it takes. So we're going to go steal a stagecoach. Let's it? do it. Now he's in a farmhouse just northwest of here called Carmody Dell. Carmody Dell. Like train tracks as you're heading up towards Fort Wallace. There's also some money in that house, but that's your business, not mine. But don't kill nobody. Folks know we ain't intimate no more. They'll know it was me. But you're fine with us robbing your cousin. By marriage. And yes, <laughs> I love it. <laughs> you're the man. Let's go rob his cousin. By marriage. <laughs> By marriage. All right. Let's operation keep Brago alive for this mission. Really? Really. Alrighty. Oh, lead the way. He said the place is just Alrighty, I'm leading the way. Let's go do another mission here. here. See if Hosea will let us pick the pace. He will. Let's just go ahead and skedaddle on up there. Carmody Dell. I guess that's good. Actually, we have three lives with, uh, with Brago here. <laughs> Brago can die three times, and then after that, we'll have to go to a stable and get some more, uh, get some more horror survivors. Tapping shift in time with your horse's gallop will stop its stamina from draining. Seriously? I didn't know that. That's cool. What things? This place. The gang. Oh, Sticky then that's going to happen. Good, I think. Sticky I keys. I figured more folks would have cut and run on us, given everything that That's happened. why I don't do shift key. Like Dutch always says, <laughs> a lone wolf don't last. 
Good lord. Alright, so we have this little uh, thing up here. We're very close. Oof. <laughs> you ran into me. Alright, I'm gonna get off my horse here. Yep. She's going foot from here. Let's see what we're dealing with. Come on. All right, Jose, let's go. Scope out Carmony Dell. Go hide behind this rock. There's the house. I see the barn in the back. Stagecoach has to be in there. Can you keep walking? Okay. Nope. Let's take a quick look at the place. All right. Take a quick look here. Zoom. Okay. Nope. Okay. I reckon we could do it now. There's probably someone there. I'll get the coach. You can try the house. Or wait until morning when I'll head over, distract them by putting on a little show. While you sneak into the house, find what you can, and then get the stagecoach. What do you think? Day sounds better. Just wait. Waiting sounds a lot better. A little distraction. Okay. <laughs> Let's get on with this, Mr. Uh, Morgan. Yes. <clears throat> Let me head up there and make a fool of myself. <laughs> with pleasure. <laughs> Just don't get caught. Because it's me, they'll shoot first. All right, so we have to do this stealthily. Let's see how good of a job we do. Wait until I have them distracted outside, then sneak into the house. We'll do, buddy. I'm going to go hide up here, I think. And then I'll cut around to the left here. I'm going to hang out here for a minute. We'll see how this goes. Rob the house of forty-five dollars worth of items. Is your father home, son? Sure is. Get him down here, please. Get him down here. Get lost, Mister. I was lost for many years. I was lost many years. Now I'm not. And you know what? Oh, oh here he is. Here he is. Are you the father of the house? Sure. Pleasure to meet you. I was just chatting with Junior here a bit. You selling something, partner? I'm not selling, sir. I'm giving it away. <laughs> All right, let's go into the house here. Just telling, uh, uh, your, oh, Junior, what's your name, son? Robert Crawford III, sir. Oh, pleasure to meet you. Both of you, sir. My name Anything I can get out of these drawers? There we go. Gold pocket watch. How much is that worth? Ten dollars. Okay. There's the medicine chest here. I can't take any snake oil. There's this chest here. This is nerve wracking. Platinum band and a money clip. Absolutely. Fifteen more dollars to go. Anything in here? Nope. Here we go. Get to the barn unseen. That's very easy. I'll just go ahead and go out the way I came in here. It's like Thief Simulator here. I rubbed 40. I could probably get more, but you know. See if I can get, uh, get through the barn to the back here. Nope, I can go. Can I go this way? No. Here we go, sneaking in. Wait for. I'm gonna listen to what he's saying. I 
I get to wait. Waiting Simulator 2023. Yeah. 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 And there we go. <laughs> Now we get to wait for him. I'm gonna kind of hang out over here now in case we have to like get out of here real quick. That was a fun little stealth mission. <laughs> I was kind of expecting him to do something a little bit uh more extravagant, but you know. He did his job, so now we get to wait for him to get in here. Here he comes. You done, Arthur? Yep. Okay, let's grab this stagecoach and get out of here. All right, I guess I'm driving. Here we go. Yeehaw! We out of here. Thanks, gentlemen. <laughs> See you later. <laughs> Oh, don't worry. I'm getting out of here. This this bad boy is going full speed. Damn it. I think you should have been more careful. Yeah, sorry. Must have left the dresser open. Hey, slow it down. Whoa, whoa. Okay. $49 worth, Hosea. <laughs> the Grizzly, I remember that. Alright. I wish this thing would have like a set speed you could go. <laughs> Didn't flinch, huh? If my memory serves me correctly, he like ran away or jumped out of the way or something. Or fell. I don't remember what happened, but I, he flinched for sure. Just some off-roading here. This is a good stagecoach. It handles very well. We go any faster. Hello, Seamus. We met your cousins. How was it? Fine. Nice people. Mm. Park that thing in here. Quickly. I'm going as quick as I can here. Uh, there we go. Nice work, Hosea. It was mostly Arthur. Like I said, coarse but competent. Here. Thank you. If you find any other coaches that need selling, I'll see what I can offer you for them. But discreet, you know. Of course. Goodbye, gentlemen. I'm heading back to camp, I think. You coming? Sure. Guess I'm heading back to camp too. Reevaluate what missions we have and what we're gonna do next. But yeah, there we go. We finally did a mission. We spent like 20 minutes running around in circles with the horse, trying to figure out how to get the horse. Then I took a little bit of an intermission to grab a snack and a break, and then uh, we're back at it now. Now I'm hydrating. All right, here we are at camp. Are we supposed to go faster than there, or what are we doing here? There we go, the Spines of America. The gang got $175. We should look at purchasing some upgrades. I know that I tried to do a little bit of research on the camp here, but I wasn't able to do much, but we'll see what we can do here for them. Miss runs a fence, visit a fence to sell valuables, buy illicit goods, or craft talismans and trinkets. Okay, interesting, interesting. All right, well, here we are in the camp. Let's go over to the ledger. 
Here's see what Dutch has to say here. Mr. Morgan, Mr. Morgan, I've noticed you've stopped paying into the box. What do you mean stop paying into the box? Hmm. Well, we all need to eat. I've been bringing you guys deer and animals to eat. I was going to purchase some necessary upgrades for the camp. What do you mean I'm not contributing or donating to the box? Watch this, Mrs. Morgan. Watch this. Let me go to the ledger here. Let's make a purchase real quick. Let's see, has she made any... Has she made anything? Let's see. She hasn't made any donations. She's complaining that I haven't donated. She hasn't donated anything either. All right. Uh, let's go ahead and get a... Uh, let's go ahead and restock what we already have here. Oh, I need to use Q and E to move. Okay. Um, restock ammo. See, I thought I had more money, but I guess I don't. I was going to buy the leather working tools upgrade, but we don't have the money for it. Okay, well... Maybe I'll go ahead and be generous and donate. Let's see. I need to figure out how much money this is because I'm going to donate just as much as I need for this. Okay. Dutch wants something comfier. Well, unfortunately, we're not getting something comfy for Dutch. All right, let's go ahead and donate 110 bucks and then purchase the, up the leather working tool upgrade or whatever it was called. All right, contribute. Let's go ahead and give money. Donate amount. Well, we're going to hold this down for a hot minute here. $110. They can't complain that I don't donate money now. <laughs> they cannot complain. <laughs> okay. Arthur is always the highest contributor, but they always complain. So, yeah, they do always complain, don't they? All right. Now I'm burning up here. All right. You can make extra gear. You know what? Let's do that. I want to purchase this. Pearson can now craft upgrades for your satchel. That is good because I need a better satchel for sure. Because I need to be able to hold more than like a few items. But okay. So we have 10 bucks to the camp's name, which that's perfectly fine. I don't really care about the camp too much, honestly. Um, let's go ahead and go over and see what some of these upgrades cost. I know that we're going to need to probably do some hunting. Good morning. Good morning. Crafting upgrades. Mr. Morgan, bring me some materials and satchel. Okay, nice ingredient satchel. We need a perfect deer pelt, a perfect badger pelt, and a perfect squirrel pelt. Okay. So... Upgrade the provisions wagon twice at the ledger. Okay, so in order to... I, I really want the provisions satchel. But in order for me to get that, I have to upgrade the provisions wagon twice. It's probably going to cost me a little bit of money, but. All right. So kit satchel, a perfect elk and a perfect panther. Panther's going to be kind of difficult, I feel. You'll need to bring me the right materials first, Mr. Morgan. I understand that. I'm just looking at the options, Pearson. Okay. Um, I guess the ingredient satchel would be good to get. We need a perfect badge and a perfect squirrel. We're not going to focus on that right now, but. Okay. We craft all their satchels to get the Legend of the East satchel. Okay. Um, we'll go ahead and come back to that later. Gonna think about it. But for now, what we're going to do is let's pick up another story mission because that is what we are doing. We're playing the story mode. Um, I need. To, I really need to go to Javier down here. But let's let's go up here to uh, Mary Linton. Let's talk to Mary. Up here in Valentine. We'll do that mission. Then we'll go to Javier. Try to be a little more careful this time. This dude in the background. Meaning? I'm trying to listen to Dutch and this dude over here is singing about being frisky with whiskey. All in good time. <laughs> Always the show, man. Dutch is over here. All right, we're going to go and let that guy sing. We're going to go ahead and jump on our horse and uh, get on up north of Valentine here and talk to Mary. Yep. And then we'll go rescue or rescue Javier. We'll go figure out what Javier is up to down near Blackwater. To 
the wide open world of Red Dead Redemption we go. Beautiful morning out here, it looks like. I think it's morning, at least. Here we go. One of the benefits of riding all over the place is we get to bond with our horse a little bit better, so that's a plus. I also need to figure out how to unlock the fast travel. Oh, this guy again. I talked to him earlier when I was playing off stream. Let's see what he wants. Hey, buddy. Can I get a buck, mister? Sure. Morning, sir. Morning. Sure. Thank you. Oh, thank you, mister. Get some positive, uh, some positive morale there for doing that that's good honor is what i was looking for the word i was looking for be stirring up more trouble around here i'll be stirring up as much trouble as i need to i didn't stir up trouble with the bar tommy did, what did I do to you? nothing yet <laughs> i'm like riding through town and everyone has a problem with me like seriously chill out everybody What's your damn problem? just trying to you know ride my horse through town here that whole oh, that is a nice horse right there. I like that horse. What kind of horse is that? Let me greet him. Oh, never mind. It's all good. Calm down. I love that horse. That is a beautiful horse. I want that horse. I'm tempted, but I need to be honorable. And I also have to do story missions. We'll we'll get a horse some other time. We'll actually go looking for a good horse. Is that a buckskin? That is a beautiful horse. Thank you, Jester. Tell me what that was. I'm gonna have to go find one of those because that horse looks really good. All right. Well, this is uh, what's her name over here? We have to go inside here to talk to her. Yes. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to disturb you, ma'am. She comes up like, the door with a gun. What? Is, um, is Mrs. Linton in? I'll go see. Mrs. Linton? A collar for you. Ah, <sighs> dihydrogen monoxide. Hydrate, hydrate. Hello, Arthur. I heard you and your friends was around. I... Okay. Where's what's his name? Died. Get the Buttermilk Buckskin Kentucky Saddler yeah, and Pronghorn Ranch. Too. Okay, I'm gonna have to go do that at some point. A while ago. Pneumonia. Bad business. Sure. So, uh... Well, you, you've been... <clears throat> Awkward conversation. You've been made widow <laughs> and you come here looking for me, is that it? No. Ain't like that, Arthur. Oh, okay. I... My family... I need your help. You mean the family that always looked down on me? You want me to help? It's my little brother, Jamie. A brother. I always liked Jamie. At least compared to the rest of them. He's broken Daddy's heart. Daddy has a heart. Don't make me beg you, Arthur. My money, my life, me. I wasn't good enough. I'm sorry. We need your help real bad. Little Jamie's joined the Chelonians, that strange religious Chelonians, order. oh boy. They're quite mad, Arthur. They'll kill him. You're the only person he'd listen to. So, I'm too rough to marry into your family, but it's okay to ask me to help in saving your family. I'm sorry. I understand if you don't want to help me, but... But I think of you often. 
Long time ago now. I'm begging you, Arthur. I say let Jamie live Jamie's life and not the nightmare that his daddy dreamed up for him. Jamie's so innocent, Arthur. Please, Arthur. Will you help me? I'm I'm kind of can inclined to help her. Where is it? Somewhere out near Carmody Dell, I think. Carmody Dell, right we were just there. there. Seen, seen him around the Cumberland Forest area. I just want him back, Arthur. If you find him, bring him to me at the station. I'll see what I can do. All right, we're gonna go help. Uh, I'll owe you. Help Mary here. You already owe me. All right. We get positive honor for not abandoning him. It's good. All right, so we got a ML all the way up here. Mary needs your help bringing her brother Jamie home from a cult called the Chelonians. That sounds interesting. Let's go ahead and head up there and uh, go get her little brother. Then we need to go to Javier, because poor Javier's been down near Blackwater for God knows how long. Come on, horse. You can go faster than this. Is it because I'm in Valentine or near Valentine? There we go. Nice little scenic ride through here. What is this person doing here? Oh, hey, you there. Think you could help a lady out? My horse up and died on me, twisted my ankle something fierce. Think you could give me a ride? Where am I giving you a ride to? Oh, thank you, sir. Thank you. I can actually do a stranger mission. You know Emerald Ranch. Emerald Ranch? I do. Is that in the general direction of where I'm going? Uh yeah, sort of, kind of. Okay, I guess we're gonna do this little stranger mission here, real quick. Yep, sure. Glad I ran into you. Huh. I raised that horse, you know. Raised it since it was just a foal. Oh, losing a horse is hard. Yeah, I just lost there. my horse. Yeah, <laughs> Got horse shot right and died me. in the field in Blackwater. My husband, truth be told. That I didn't raise it, but you know, it was my first horse in the game. It? Sad. To lift a take a little detour horse. here, folks. We're going to take this lady down to Emerald Ranch, and then we're going to head up and look for uh, Mary's little brother. He was a fine animal. Loyal, smart, brave. Loyal, smart, and brave. Not from no one. Had one of them mountain boys pull a gun on me once. Which way does a woman to go? I'm going to go to the right here. My horse is probably going to get tired a lot more easily now that there's someone on the, on the back there. I should say there's another person back there now. Well, he gets wheezing on and I must have made some sort of noise because the next thing I know, Biscuit had nipped his ear clean off. Kicked his hide too as he's <laughs> away. Didn't think a man could run so fast. Oh yeah. Yeah. Take a little off road in here. We don't have to follow the road. I tell the husband, what does he do? Should have never gone over there, honey, he says. Gee, thanks. <coughs> so, you live in Here's Emerald Ranch. Ranch. For the time being, I was looking for work. They was looking for. I have to clean my horse when I get there too. If I waited any longer for my husband to put food on the table, I'd have died of starvation. I'll be moving on soon, though. Emerald Ranch, well, it's a strange place. Definitely, it seems like a strange the place. A mean bastard. Strange too. The lights in bullying folk. There's a daughter, but she never leaves the house. You can see her in the window sometimes. Oh, we're getting close now. We are getting close because it took a detour across the nice open field. Here we go. Here you go, ma'am. Here we go. This is great. This 
this was kind of you, mister. Please, take this as my way of thanking you. All right, we got a silver emblem ring. It. <sighs> what a lousy day. Fancy, yeah, I'd say it's a lousy day. Hopefully it gets better for you there, but let's go ahead and head back up to uh, Cumberland Forest. I actually did a side mission for once and I didn't decline it and make someone mad at me. The poor dude from like New York wanted me to give him a ride to Strawberry. I was going right there. So I was like, yeah, sure, buddy. And then it didn't give me an offer to accept. So I was like, okay, maybe I need to refuse and make him walk with me. But then he's like, just leave me out here to die. There's a dead deer. Rest in peace. Let's go ahead and see where we have to go up here. Uh, it's not too bad. It's going to be up in the woods there. It wants me to take a... I might have to take a path up there because it looks like it's kind of up in a mountain a little bit. But we'll go ahead and go see how far we can get up here. My horse is getting tired. I need to clean my horse real quick. Yeah, I just remembered. There we go. Slow down a little bit. And the horse is like instantly cleaned. And there's level two bonding. We're now level two with Brego. Increase the level four, that's good. Energy is increased as well. Stamina, I should say. Run up here through the forest, through all the, uh, the rocks. I remember when I first started playing Red Dead Online, I had a horse. Uh, I, I got an Arabian and that horse, I don't know what was wrong with it, but it was literally a magnet to trees and rocks and I would just constantly run into rocks and trees. And it was also a magnet for cliff edges and, you know, edges of bridges and stuff. Because, uh, I went off a few bridges here and there. I ended up selling it and getting rid of it because I just couldn't take it anymore. It was really annoying. Anyway, here we are. Looking for a... Uh, well, this is a little cult camp here, I see. Chelonia, they're doing a little chant over here. Let's go ahead and figure out what's going on. Here we go. Shell of safety. <laughs> Shell of safety. I'm just here to share to talk. Can I, can I talk? <clears throat> Shell of safety. Shell of safety. Gotta speak to the boy. Arthur? Hello, son. Your sister is very worried. The boy has chosen a path, sir. The path to truth. This is a nice view, actually. Not gonna lie. His sister just wants to speak. They picked a great place to practice a cult up here. I've chosen a path. The boy has chosen a path. He's chosen safety. What path have you chosen, sir? I've chosen my path. Impatient. I don't know about this nonsense. Let me speak to the boy. Dut, dut. Are you always this negative and antagonistic, sir? Yes, I am. I'm Arthur. Let's apologize. I'm not a very cultured man. Forgive me, please. <laughs> I am a fool for my God and a happy one, sir. I bless you. What do I dream about? Who are my heroes? Just want to talk to the boy. That's all I want to do. Yeah, the Arabians are like that, Jess. Turtles. I have no idea. Uh, turtles. Yeah, turtles. Hey. The dream about turtles. I love turtles. I love them too. <laughs> yeah, turtles. <laughs> this dude's like, is this guy high or something or crazy? Jamie knows the truth. But of course, you may speak with him. Exactly. That's all he wanted to do. Can I do? I'm. I'm not. Have to chase I'm him not down. 
you, Arthur. Just come and speak with Mary. Then make up your mind. All right, we gotta chase him. Alrighty, we're on the chase. Chase after Jamie. I wonder where it's gonna lead me here. Alright, horse, come on, dude. Go where I want you to go. There we go. Apparently, we, we do have to do this the hard way, yeah. I'm the moron. He's the one who ran you off the road. What are you talking about? Oh man, I thought my horse was gonna like completely crash there. My horse is gonna crash. Horse was gonna fall over. That was a big jump. Man, I wanted to like check out the view from up there. I'll have to go there on uh online and see what the view is from up there too at some point. My horse is now tired. Do I have anything for my horse at all? I do. Here we go. Some horse stamina. Just want to talk to you, buddy. Do I have to like lasso him off or do I just keep running after him? I don't know what we're doing here. You little jackass. Oh, he's threatening me now. Oh, he's shooting. Uh oh. My horse is getting tired. I'm gonna have to use another uh, onic here. Uh oh. Shot. Now his horse is away. Leave me alone. Please, kid. Put that gun down. I warn you, Arthur. I'm. I'm gonna. I don't want to live anymore. Kid, just calm down. Leave me alone. Uh oh. Uh oh. Can I shoot his gun out of his hand? There we go. I was like, I don't want to have to shoot him. <laughs> Let's go see your sister. I was holding the wrong button. I was like, why isn't this thing okay. charging? Okay. Nobody had to die. Have I been a terrible fool, Arthur? I don't know. I don't know enough about it. Well, one thing I do know, there ain't no shame in looking for a better world. I missed you, Arthur. Are you and Mary sweet on one another again? Oh, no. Nope, we ain't sweet. I've That's never even met Mary. Ago, son. All right, let me go ahead and kill my waypoint because I don't need it anymore. Let's go ahead and ride back over to Mary. Yeah. Well, this wasn't how I thought today would turn out. It's been a long time, Jamie Gillis. You were a kid last time I saw you. you. Didn't try to kill yourself. You know, you taught me how to ride a horse. A little backstory with uh, Jamie here. Slonia, though. Really? You'd fall for that? They were very nice to me. They're decent. Arthur's ex lover. Yeah, I've I've never met her. That's that's what I was referring to. Arthur might have met her. Well, definitely met her, but. Oh, oh, that was that was bad. <laughs> I, that there might be good I was paying attention to the road there, but if I wasn't actually paying attention, I probably would have ran right into that carriage. Probably would have failed the mission there because, you know, I would have killed Jamie or something like that or myself. Forgive me. 
Take a little shortcut through here. Let me go ahead and slow down. Listen to the dialogue here. <laughs> Please send him my worst regards. Reminds me of uh, Gus and online. Please send Harriet my worst regards. <laughs> Token, you must really like shooting and robbing people. I'm enjoying the story mode so far. Father told me what you do. Definitely gonna take a few streams to cover everything. Howdy, Carissa. Welcome. And Annabelle and Bessie? I'm afraid they're dead. Shit. Maybe Mary did make the right choice. A few streams, yeah. <laughs> so, are you two getting back together? Here we are. She must be waiting inside. I'm gonna go around to the front here. Yeah, it's it's gonna probably take. I'm gonna guess between 10 and 15 streams to cover everything. But hey, we'll do 10 or 15 streams. We'll get the story mode done. Power walk. His hand must be hurt. Either that or he's cold. But anyway, let's go and bring him inside and see what Mary uh, has to say. Make it quick or I might run off again. Okay, I'll go ahead and power walk. Or it's just going to make me walk. Here we go. Father's been very sad. Father wouldn't know sadness if it died in his bed. But I'll come home for you. My boy. My sweet boy. Come on. Oh, Arthur. Thank you. Thank you. It's good to see you, Mary. And you, Arthur. And you. Make it quick. He's lumping behind you. <laughs> And off she goes. I've... You're... Oh, you'll never change. I know that. And there she goes. She's off. Well, Chris, uh, my first horse died. It was very tragic. I stole a lawman horse and made it my new one. That's where we're at. I feel like the luckiest man alive, and I feel like a fool. That woman confuses me and plays me for a fiddle like no one else alive. I trust I will not make a god awful fool of myself. It died because I was going to. Somehow I You're no better than me with plants, yeah. So. I was trying to go to, um, well, I'm going to go do it now. You can probably tell me how to do this because I don't know how to do it. I'm trying to go down here to Javier down in Blackwater. And I picked up the law right over here. And they chased me out into the field and they shot my horse and killed my horse. Well, they downed it and then it was critically injured and I tried to revive it, but I didn't have horse survivors, so I had to let it die. So I'm trying to get down here to Javier, but apparently Blackwater is a hot spot right now. Go from the side, so go from like... Cross, cross here? Go by the coastline? Okay. That's what Jess said, so I'll, I'll do that. But yeah, so my horse died, and then um... This horse over here... Actually, I should probably save real quick now that I'm thinking of it. Save game. But, oh, overwrite that save. We're now 18.6% complete. We're on a roll here. 
Okay, so I'll cross down on the coast. I didn't even go through town. Like, where where I was, I hate how long it takes to zoom out. Where I was, I was literally right here. And then I crossed the river, and there were two lawmen right here on the cliff. And they're like, hey, who are you? Yeah, so I'm I'm gonna set I'm actually gonna set my waypoint there instead. Because I'm gonna cross here. I'm I'm not gonna go that way. But, but yeah, so I, I picked up the law like right here across the river, and then they chased me into the field, and then they shot my horse, and you know. But I have this one. This is my new This is my new horse. It's a thoroughbred. Named Brego. Oh, it's Cleaning him for me. I didn't have to do that. Cool. But yeah, so this is my new horse, Brago. Horses are weak. There was one that I saw earlier. Jess said it's it's a buckskin. And uh, she said where to get it too. I want to go get go get that horse at some point because it's a really nice horse. And I'll I'll probably do that later. I'm not gonna do it now. I'm gonna start heading to this mission here. It is a nice horse for a llama horse. Yeah, it's a, it's a beautiful horse. I really like it. Let me actually go to the butcher downtown here and sell this skin that I have on the back of my... Uh, that's a beautiful horse too right there. But all the horses look good. Wait, is that it? I think, that, I think that's the horse. Or no, that's a different one, but that one looks good too. Do I dare? <laughs> Do I dare? The higher waves of the law, the better the horses have gotten a rare. Maybe I'll have to stir up some trouble then, because I want to get a good horse, but... Do, do I do this? Is this what we're doing right now? Am I stealing this horse? I'm doing it. It's a Kentucky Saddler. It's a beautiful horse. All right, I'm taking it. I'm ri I'm running. I don't know if anyone's gonna see it, but I got a horse thief. This horse is so beautiful. I love it. Let me clean it real quick. I want to see it in its beauty. This is it. Oh, it looks so beautiful. So what? I would just take this to the stable, and it's mine. Okay, I just stole it from them. <laughs> Good evening, sir. I did not just steal this here horse from you. Evening. Oh, this horse looks beautiful. I'm a time where I'm actually glad that I stole I stole a horse. <laughs> oh, I can't go to these. <laughs> Shoot. All right. Um. Well, I can't go to Blackwater. So guess what? We're gonna we're gonna head back over to Lemoyne here. And it didn't put the waypoint up. I hate this game sometimes. I really do. That's fine, Jess. Don't worry. I think this is a he. Yeah, this is a he. <laughs> Bond with it first? Okay. Well, I'm pretty sure that uh, heading over... I'll take my horse with me, but I'm pretty sure that riding over... Um, will get me some... Disco balls. Oh, go back and then let you. Okay. I'll go ahead and ride outside of town a little bit here. It's a beautiful night here. This is this is a beautiful horse. I like this horse. I'm going to be sad if this horse dies. I'm going to have always make sure that I have horse survivors with this horse. I pet it. How about if I... Uh, let's see. Let's try this. What about if I give it some... Uh, well, I can only hold three. Let's give it some celery. All right, there we go. We're gonna go back. I've never been more excited about a horse in a game than right now. I wish we could do this in Reddit online, not gonna lie, but you know. How would Rockstar make money? Where are you going? Hang on a second. Where are you going? I'm going to saddle up my my horse that I legally acquired I didn't totally just uh what you been feeding this horse take if you want me 
somebody keep that overnight. There's room in the stable. Okay. I'm gonna I think I'm gonna get rid of this horse. This is like the base horse. Yeah, legally, Biddy. <laughs> legally. I think I'm gonna get rid of this one. This is like the the starter horse that you get. Name him Bilbo. The kid name him Bilbo. Like a Bilbo. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and sell this horse. This one's worth two dollars and four. No, it's not. I'll get you switched out. All right, you're getting me switched out. Let me go ahead and uh, upgrade this horse. I need to give it a name. Services rename horse. This is a Bilbo for sure. Is that how you spell Bilbo? B i l b o. Well, you know what? We're gonna go sure. with it. Don't know if I'd want to be hollering after a horse with that name. What? How dare you insult this name, sir? He just insulted it. He just insulted Bilbo. Alright, well, I have a horse that I have illegally acquired. I mean, legally, sorry. Let me get rid of this uh, skin off the uh, the back here. This pelt. Bibble. 80 cents. Oh, this horse looks so good. Alright, well, I have accomplished something. Let's go ahead and... Head on down to... Oh, I don't have to go to that stable anymore. Let's go ahead and... Uh, where am I heading down to? The coastline here. Bibble. If I get another horse, I'll name it Bibble. I don't know about Bibble. I don't know what it is, no. Sorry, I'm not giving a penny to someone. I'm trying to do a story mission. I've had so many distractions tonight. This horse doesn't want to go. Come on, horse. You're going to have the best life ever with me. So just run, please. There we go. Is this... Can I get this horse on Reddit Online? Because I know it's it's a Kentucky Saddler. I know it's a potato, but... I would love this horse on Online. I'll pay $750 for a new stable slot. What is this? Oh, no. We're not doing this. Nope, nope, nope. All right, let's go. I'm just gonna run past this because I might die here. No, I died. This is bad, actually. Yeah. I don't know how to use Deadeye. I'm really bad. Okay, well, watch me lose the horse. I'll be very sad. I just got my new horse. And then I lose it. Oh no, I still have it. Okay. Yeah. Teach me how to use dead eye, please. Eat a venison, get my core back up here. Okay. So we had a little bit of a uh a <laughs> an issue there. Let's uh let's get back on the on the road here. Can I go down here? Yes I can. Perfect. Just got a swim pin. Sounds exciting. Oh, I know where I am. This is a bridge that uh my Arabian fell off of. I remember coming over here. Right over here. And reviving my horse. This my horse fell off this bridge when I first started playing Red Dead online. This horse looks beautiful. I have to keep this horse clean. I don't know what Bibble is, so you guys you guys have fun talking about Bibble. I guess Chris is gonna tell me what Bibble is. Yep. I guess it'll be safe-ish to follow the GPS. As we get closer, I might have to uh yeah, okay, I might have to not use the GPS because I don't want to run into the and, and lose another horse. What is this? Hey, 
Okay. I apparently have a $300 bounty in West Elizabeth. When did that happen? What did I do to deserve such a high bounty? I'm kind of like royally. Oh, here's some wolves. And there's a cliff here. So I'm kind of in trouble. Jump off this little cliff here. Come on, go horsey. You breathe. Bibble is just a little Barbie fairy. <laughs> They're so in engine scenes that it's like a fever dream. <laughs> At the Bibble meme, I have multiple mental illnesses, but Bibble looks so empty inside. Oh. And I breathe to get a $300 bounty. That's interesting. Is it like pre Red Dead Redemption 2 campaign lore that I don't know about? Slow down here with the horse, recover. Good boy. I like how Arthur talks to the horse and online we just get shh stuff like that. Yeah. Feel the wind on the trees. What is this guy doing here? Hello? Who we'll put a rock right in there. the middle of the road? Hey, you there? I that's just plain as usual. Oh, well, I had to find another wagon. What should I do, guys? Should I rob him, accept, or decline? <laughs> Thanks for joining, Diddy. Appreciate you stopping by. Thought you look like a gentleman. What? But I was mistaken. Well, I guess that took too long. Boss ain't gonna be happy about this. Well, see, sir, you've gotten yourself into that conundrum. You can get yourself out. Looks like he's yeah. drunk or something. All right, so. Where is Javier? I don't want to mess this up. Do I cross the coast? Where do I cross here? Seems like there's a camp over there. I don't want to go over there. I'm going to cross right down here. Hope I don't run into the law. There's a boat there. Got to be careful. All right. We're going to go ahead and cross here and go to the, the camp. Go to that camp up there. Is that what I'm doing? Not sure there's a little delay in the stream, so you guys probably won't see it for a minute here. I'll go up here. Okay, here he is. Oh, here we go. Okay. All right, Bilbo. Give you one more brush so you can shine in the moonlight. Good horse. I'm treating my horse like it's the last time I'm going to see it. <laughs> I'll be back. All right, let's go do this mission. How many? A lot. Uniforms everywhere. Hola, mi amigos. No, I don't think so. Damn it. Hey. Mm. Where is that little Irish best? I'm not quite sure. Trelawney's off trying to find out. Anyone been in the black water, see how things lie? Place is crawling with Pinkertons, bounty hunters, and ah. pictures of Dutch and Hosea. Uh, well, he got a lot of money sitting in Such there. a good horse, and that's the horse. Where it's gonna <laughs> remain for now. Why haven't they hanged Sean, I wonder? I think he's bait. We don't want to trial him publicly. Uh, gentlemen, Sean is being moved up the upper Montana, then to a federal prison out west. Damn. 
Gotta go get him. We can't be rescuing people from some federal prison. We either rescue him now or cut him loose. We're not cutting anyone loose. Of course not. Ike Skeldings, boys. I'm moving him to a camp nearby before handing him over to the government. How about how much effort they put so, people? I guess. Getting people back from the law, yeah. We need to stop them before they get to camp. Charles, why don't you head up on the north side? And we'll head up on the other side of the valley and meet you. That way we have them in either direction. Javier, Josiah, come on. Let's go see. All right. Going to go rescue Sean. The government, or people whom the government like, seem to be very angry. Good observation sure. there. Well, we'll rescue Sean and we'll get ourselves lost good and proper. It's a big country. I hope so. Got all our horses here. Bilbo is obviously the best out of the three. Find the boat. Let me get rid of this waypoint here real quick because it's going to trigger me. All right, we're going to go rescue Sean, I guess. Follow me. Let's see if we can then after that, uh, we'll probably conclude our stream because it is getting late for me. Yes. South of the river, West Elizabeth isn't a very welcoming place right now. It's definitely as bad as we Careful. feared in there, Arthur. There's the boat. Look, I think that's our boat. All right, gentlemen. Follow me. I will follow you. Just don't kill me. Follow them. Nice and easy. Let's make sure it's him first before you go starting another war. You think they can see us? If they can, we're just three fellas out on the trail. Act natural. We'll be fine. So... You've been gone for a while. And we get a little bit of backstory with uh sleeping in the dirt with you derelicts. I do have Josiah, I think is what his name is. What happened in New York? You know how life is. Never a straight road anywhere. Especially with you. Nice to know I missed though. Have you run out of people to rob? There's plenty of people to rob. I got tipped off by someone to rob some old lady's house. Contemplating if I should do that or not, but Let's go. Stay with them. You all right, Javier? You quiet? He hasn't stopped talking since we left you in Valentine. He hasn't stopped the talking since we left you in Valentine. Cute, dear boy. Very cute. I say they're you're getting pretty far up the river here. We're kind of running out of options. You're the one who's got to pick up the pace, dude. You're leading this. gonna follow him I'm gonna hold my shift button down because we discovered earlier that spamming the shift button uh, just opens up the sticky keys menu are they docking down there is that where the boat is yep they're beaching hey they pulled into shore get your binoc binoculars out. out let's see what we're dealing with here Copy that. So who are these bounty hunters? I don't know too much about Ike Skeldon's boys, but I hear they're a big crew, wild, built some reputation in the last... That looks like Sean. That looks like Sean to me. Certainly kicking up enough of a... Fuss. Oh, they just yeah, hit him with the butt of a gun there. definitely Sean. Oh, they're giving him a decent kicking. Well, you can only imagine the shit he's been giving them. Oh, yes. We imagine the shit we're about to give them. There's Charles on the other side. Let's go. There's Charles. I've got an idea. Follow me. Got an idea. Copy that, Ghost Rider. Just you gotta go, bro. Zoom zoom. Let's go. Getting off our horses. Cause it won't let me go anywhere. Quietly, if we can. Gladly. To me, gentlemen, I'll go around and create a distraction. Then you two sneak across.
boss and do the dirty on them. I'll do the dirty on them. I'll throw a throwing knife. Get your knife ready. Keep your head down. Wait. Let's get in the river. Wait until he's got them off guard before crossing. Give me that. I guess they wanted me to actually use my knife knife. Okay, Javier, you're shoving me into a rock, bro. <laughs> Good job, Josiah. He didn't kill him. Come on, let's get up there. There he did. A pleasure as always, gentlemen. I think you have it from here. Come on. We got two halfway up the canyon to deal with. We do indeed have two halfway up the canyon. I don't know what we're doing here. <laughs> when he's having. <laughs> Come on. How do they see? Ooh, right in the face. I'm trying. No, I'm getting shot at Javier. It ain't easy. Splat. I'll let the horse do the work for me there. Yep. Right in the face. Perfect. No time to loot. Just kidding. A little bit of time to loot. <laughs> My shooting is so good. Thank you. I just, you know, <laughs> I try. I don't know how people didn't hear all this gunfire, but here we go. Charles, you take the right. I'll go left. Okay. Let's take these equipments. Damn army of these. How much is Charles found? That guy's gonna die there. The guy shooting for the tower is dead. Don't worry about it. Peace. Swat. Okay. Do a wheel. Let's go. Oh. <laughs> he got shot before I could. Up here, Sean. All right. I need to switch back to my repeater here. I need to find some cover. He did. No survivors. Okay. Let's get Sean. I loot a little bit before I get Sean. Yeah, I will, dude. Give me a second here. I'm just, you know, stealing things from people. It's all good. Calm down, buddy. Okay, let's go get Sean. Just leave, let him hang here, you know? That'd be nice, though. <laughs> Just let him drop. <laughs> you know, 
You're a lot less ugly from that other angle, Arthur. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> a lot less ugly from that Get other on, angle. Arthur. A warm embrace for a lost brother now found. <laughs> you know, nothing means more to me than this gang. The bond we share. It's the most real thing to me. I would kill for it. I would happily die for it. But in spite of all of that, I would have easily left you here to rot if Charles hadn't stopped me. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. Him out of here. You're a great man, Arthur Morgan. The kind of young whippersnapper can really admire. Oh, shut up. Right, <laughs> we should split up. Javier, will you escort Mr. McGuire back to camp? Charles, best you ride separately. Be careful. There's patrols everywhere. This is going to be fun to but get you, back to camp. I'm going to see what's worth taking here. I'll meet you back there as soon as I can. All right. So I get to explore. Okay, to loot. On. Okay. Have I got stories for you? Yeah. I can't wait. I imagine y'all miss me a lot, but fear not. We'll loot up this camp here, and then we'll head back to, uh... Got a tomahawk. Nice. I'm gonna go ahead and loot these bodies, and I'll search around here a little bit. And then Bilbo is here. Hello, Bilbo. My trusty steed. Get a little bit of money. I have a $300 bounty to pay off here. Should I pay my bounty off here in West Elizabeth, Carissa? Or Jess, if you're still watching, would, would that is that a recommended strategy here? Because it kind of sucks that I can't go anywhere in West Elizabeth without the threat of the law. Like, like I get I'll probably be wanted if I go into town, but like going near town. Like paying off bounties, okay. I'm gonna need to do some some money gathering then. <laughs> Make some money. I don't think I'm able to get up to this dude here. Some places you can't play play. You can't pay bounties. I have red here. What does that mean? Uh oh. Those are bounty hunters. Nope. Yep. All right. I'm getting out of dodge. Try to bleed me out, huh? All right, now I get to lose these guys real quick. Well, I guess I'm not gonna check that area out. Let me open up the map and set my waypoint where I'm supposed to be going. There's Strawberry. I'm not going that way. I'm supposed to be up towards Valentine. John needs to speak to me at camp. Well, John, just as soon as I get the opportunity, I will gladly speak with you, my good sir. All right, let's go ahead and uh, cross here. Let's head towards camp. That's where we need to go, so. Lake and Blackwater Saw of West Elizabeth is out of limits now. So I can't, I can't pay a bounty off in uh. In the West Elizabeth, I guess. If I can get ahead of this, these bounty hunters. Please don't tell me they're coming up this way. I'm gonna. Oh, they are. You know what? We're gonna go off road in here. That's what we're gonna do. Come on, Bilbo, you got this. These bounty hunters are ruthless. I'm gonna try to cross the railroad here. Do I have to kill these guys or do I just escape? Can't pay those now. Okay, so like West Elizabeth is off, is off limits right now. Then got it. And OBS, why are you dropping so many frames on me? It's not a lot, but it's still some. 0.5 percent. My horse is tired. Okay. Well, the bounty hunters didn't really do a good job, did they? I can find some uh, some carrots. Get some carrots to my horse. Well, I already have carrots. What am I talking about? Carrot. There we go. Okay, boy. Here, Bilbo, have a carrot. Hey, Bilbo, like the carrot. Oh, yeah. bounty hunters again. Yeah. Come on. I'm also in West Elizabeth, right? No, I just left. It's 
why the bounty hunters are after me. Camp is just up ahead a little bit. You're all right, boy. All right, we're coming up on camp here, I think. Getting pretty close. Go ahead and... Looks like we have a little bit more to go. It's on the other side of the cliff. Okay, I see. Hang in there, Bilbo. We're almost back to the camp. Nice little camp area, though, not gonna lie. Ooh. Take a, a gift back with us if it'll let us. Three star buck? I might sell that, honestly. If I can catch it. It, Bilbo. <laughs> Is it even worth chasing that? No. Well, Bilbo, you just you kind of ruined it there, buddy. Sorry. <laughs> okay, Bilbo's a little clumsy in the movies, so. <laughs> Alright, we're back here at camp. Go ahead and Hitch my horse. Let me see if I can uh, save my game here real quick, if it'll let me. Currently unable to main to save. Okay, well let's see what uh, see what goes on here when we get into the camp. Looks like Arthur needs a bath. We'll talk to Dutch. I guess that's what he's going to talk to is Dutch. But let's go ahead and have a word with Dutch. Let's have some fun. His mouth isn't even moving. Let's enjoy ourselves. We have what is the dude in the background doing? What? Did anyone see that? The dude above Dutch's head. This. What was this guy doing over here? He like bent over. Was Pearson do? What the heck? Dutch's mouth wasn't moving, and this dude like. It'll be nothing but the, the finest game in the pot. Now <laughs> Deadeye Maguire's back. That was really weird. <laughs> and don't worry about nothing, Mrs. Grimshaw. We'll have this camp. I'll have to go back and watch that later. <laughs> Holy cow. I love you, bastards. <laughs> have fun. Have lots of fun. <laughs> I'm sure you will. Give me three can we drink now, please? Uh -oh, here comes All right, so the gang will be celebrating for a while. Let's go ahead and celebrate with them. Go and have a beer. Go ahead and just drink a whole beer right about here. Yep, yep, there we go. That hits the spot. Well, they'll be celebrating for a while. I don't know what to do here. I guess sleep, maybe? Go find out. Oh, they're gonna play a song. Let's see what they they play here. Just bickering. I'll start singing too. It's not letting me sing. There we go. 
<laughs> Arthur doesn't know the lyrics. Just gonna celebrate here. Very nice sunset over there. Dash is like, I'm done. <laughs> Right. It is a beautiful sunset, yeah. But how about something a little more, a little more civilized? How about I could just... Is this my, my tent here? Can I sleep? Go ahead and sleep. Till morning. <laughs> Let them have their party. We had a little bit of fun. Arthur's like, oh, I'm tired. I'm going to sleep. Yeah, we rescued Sean. We had a little bit of fun. And now we have missions we can do. Let's see if I can save my game now. Hopefully. There we go. We can do manual save. Alright, let's go and override our save here. 19.2%. Nice. Alright, guys. Well, I think that, uh... I'm gonna go ahead and end my stream here. It is getting pretty late. I'm going a little bit past what I wanted to, but that's okay. But anyway, guys, there's a floating beer bottle here. That's awesome. It's cool. The magical beer bottle. <laughs> but anyway, guys, I'm gonna go ahead and end my stream here. I uh, appreciate everyone for joining. Uh, Jess, thanks for showing up and hanging out. Carissa, I appreciate you showing up as well. And then everyone before, I believe Phantom was in there too. Uh, but yeah, if you guys enjoyed, definitely leave a like. And the beer bottle's gone. And it went to him, went to the... <laughs> this dude's... Is he gonna follow me? Is creep gonna follow me here? Yep. Alright, we're gonna go ahead and just speed walk away from here. Hey yeah, guys, thank you so much for watching the stream. Um, I'll be streaming tomorrow, 3pm Central Time. I'm gonna be playing some American Truck Simulator. So uh, definitely feel free to... Uh, to join me for that, and I'll probably stream Reddit again on Monday, because Rockstar updated Grand Theft Auto, and uh, they, they broke the game. I'm trying to get away from this guy. He's running after me. Yeah, you have a good night as well, uh, well, Jess. Dude, this game is bugged. Anyway, thanks for joining, guys. Hope you guys have a good night and a fantastic weekend. I will see you guys tomorrow. 3 p.m. Central Time for some American Truck Simulator. Take care, guys.